All right. So we have many people here to celebrate my birthday. We have Kermit the Frog. We have Macho Man Randy Savage. We have Cowboy <laughs> Dave. We have uh, Thanos. We have um, the Dewey Decimator System. Dewey Decimator System. <laughs> That's the first I've heard of that one. I like that. We have a, uh, we have a uh, Space Hulk, Water Hulk, and Lava Hulk. We have the Poop Shit Squad. All right, that wasn't that wasn't the. Oh wait, that was, sorry, I'm not gonna comment on on the Poop Shit Squad. <laughs> I was like, that wasn't the most elegant of tweets I made, but it was a tweet. That's my. And it's ent- out there. I was just listing out my whole entourage. <laughs> <laughs> a, your resume for, for gangs you've been in throughout your lifetime. Yep. The Chile Rianos. The Chile Rianos. The East Coast Boppers. <laughs> oh man, it's been a wild 30 years, John. <laughs> 30 long years. <laughs> it's quite the resume you got there, Dale. Yes. <laughs> I'm fucking excited to find out what that, what that cake's like. That's If it's as sweet as. Brandon says it is. Okay. Every time I hear cake, I think of the This is Sparta, and they go, This is Cake Town! It's gotta be Cake you Town. You know Brandon's gonna OD on sugar on the way over, right? Right. Oh, it's gonna happen. OD on sugar. <laughs> he's, he's just never gonna arrive. We're gonna walk out to our cars, and he's hanging out of his <laughs> with a bunch of frosting around his mouth. Frothing. Hey, hey, hey Nevermore Painting Studio. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Pour some sugar on me. <laughs> oh, that's like I think that that might have been one of the first uh, things I've watched that was inappropriate for my age because HBO was on um, my family's fucking TV plan when I was younger. It was some like documentary on sloshing, which is like what? about like a, a food fetish kind of thing where like <laughs> you know <laughs> you just like rub each other down with like with things like cake, whatever else. And that was the thing. Is that what pour some sugar on me is about? <laughs> I mean, that's, I mean wait, wait. That, that's kind of what I'm, I'm insinuating. I can't confirm nor deny this, but... That makes sense. It's kind of on the nose. <laughs> I mean. Anyways, uh, yeah, please uh, put parental guidance on your TVs. I mean, I wasn't even sure what the fuck I was watching, <laughs> quite honestly. I, 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 that encourages me to not put parental guys on my TV and just teach my kids. <laughs> well, kids, pour some sugar on me. <laughs> the world is a scary place. The world is a scary place. Uh, I gotta wake up a little bit. I don't want to. I don't want to drink one of those ball things because, like, you want to split one? You want to split some balls? <laughs> <laughs> I'm alright this time, thank you, thank you. You're okay. <laughs> it's, I've had way too many sugar drinks over the weekend. It's okay, we're gonna too get too many sugar rush from that cake. Too much rose. Yeah, they have exactly. sugar free sugar free balls. Sugar free balls. balls. I would like that. Pour some sugar on me. I'm I'm one of those kind of people just drinks <clears throat> sugar free stuff all the time. I probably can... a lot worse for me, but you know, it's part of me. Dude, Can't go wrong. Probably due to the horrors you've seen, I get it. <laughs> I mean, it's only answer eventually. <laughs> oh man, yeah, I mean, you gotta know that. Diet stuff not that great for you, not good in the long run. <laughs> so you know, definitely wean yourself off that if you can. Everything. Although I fucking do that shit all the time. Honestly. Everything either gives you diabetes or cancer. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, fucking so, dude. Sugar <laughs> causes cancer too, actually. No. Yeah. Yeah. Don't yeah. do blammy. So I do the little like brown bits on top of my pan. <laughs> I just got ceramic pans, so ceramic pants? Oh no, I mean like even like pans. little burnt ends on, on food oh, gotcha. are so carcinogenic. Oh gotcha. Oh, yeah, gotcha. Fucking biology taught me a lot about that kind of shit. It's like everywhere. What is it? <laughs> Die from poisoning from granite tabletops? Yeah. You can get poisoning from granite tabletops? How? Uh they have radon in them. Oh, oh radon. Radon. Oh, I didn't know that. Everything's trying to kill us. Yeah, I, I like a lot of surfaces, so this is the kind of stuff I really need to, to learn and memorize. <laughs> you that's, either die that's great for a pandemic. <laughs> yeah, I know. I've been having a hard time with this. <laughs> <laughs> Greetings, fellow Magic the Gathering fans. 
Big Man Tyrone here to welcome you to my favorite Twitch stream, MTG Lexicon. They are the stream to watch for casual physical games of magic. That's right, real cards, live, unscripted, and most assuredly, not sober. Remember, MTG Lexicon is for mature audiences only, and it is in no way affiliated with Wizards of the Coast or Hasbro. <laughs> MTG Lexicon does not condone drinking unless you are of legal age. Come join the stream every Saturday for live play, giveaways, and drunken antics. Get comfortable. The next round is on us. <laughs> heard that one if it played maybe maybe okay. um. <laughs> kick it off Dale <laughs> That's a fuck. I forgot how long that song is. Yeah. Hey, what's up, everyone? Welcome, guys. Welcome, <laughs> one and all, to MTG Lexicon, the dive bar of EDH, and we're here for your filthy, drunken, so guilty, g- guilty. Say another word. Take, take, Say another take word. Commander or casual. <laughs> yeah. <Drunken>. Content. <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> that was a beautiful one. Yeah, that was, I fucking love it. Um, yeah, to, to those that are curious about our intro, we, we've actually had to stop our song due to some copyright things. Oh, yeah, yeah. So we, we were like just running kazoo things every time. <laughs> Let me tell you, I'm, I am I never quite prepared this for this. Apparently, I, I am a blasphemer for not knowing Freddie Mercury songs. So we got to work on that. He's... Very yes, particular song that you don't know. That particular song. I mean, maybe if I heard it, maybe. Oh, dude, it's a banger. <laughs> maybe. It's okay. We'll jam to it someday. All right. So um, I'm one of your hosts over here, uh, Johnny Horsefather Deluxe, um, as you might see me around. And we have two wonderful guests joining us here today. And the player two spot, we have John Samurai Dancer. Why don't you talk about yourself for a second? Uh, hi, I'm Samurai Dancer. I'm mostly known for playing black decks. I think every deck I own except uh, one is pretty much black, and not even the ones that aren't completely black are just mostly black decks. I'm known as Mono Black with a different face. Nice. Mono I respect black the commitment. Uh, today I'm going to be playing uh, Trin and Silvar. This is humans eating humans. I mean, we're just tasty people when you get down to it. <laughs> I can't uh, deny that. That's fun. Nor confirm it. <laughs> it's basically just going to be Sacrifice Human Tribal with Yagmoth, Species Specialist, Judith standing out. And then we've got a sub theme of the Monarch, hopefully to get that into play very fast. Nice. All right. I'm loving it. And then in the player three spot, we have John from Spell Table. Hello and welcome, and welcome back. Hey, thanks for having me. Why don't you talk about yourself a little bit and what you do? Sure. Uh, so I'm the co-founder of Spelltable. Um, we make a website to make uh, playing EDH and other formats of magic easy over webcam. And uh, yeah, so I've come today with Jura of the Gitu, and uh, this is a very unoptimized deck that is sometimes very good, most of the time very bad. All uh, right. But, <laughs> now that's balanced. The goal, is, <laughs> the goal is to yeah, the goal is to get big things that I wouldn't be able to afford otherwise uh-huh. out early. Uh, using suspend, which is not a very common uh, ability. Fun. It's not. I'm really looking forward to getting my love face suspend. smashed in by an 11-11. It could that's happen. That's what I love. 
And then in player four spot, we have the birthday boy himself. Hey, hey, guys. You know him. You love him. Everybody's favorite grumpy uncle is Dale Doe Baggins, the bad boy of EDH. I'm here playing with my main man, Gishath, the sun's avatar, a.k.a. Jurassic Shark. Here, <laughs> poop out dinosaurs and wreck face. I added about seven dinosaurs since you guys last seen him. And so hopefully I'll be more successful. With that, I'm going to go ahead and open up betting. And All right. see who goes first. <sighs> let's, first, let's roll four. And I think my body is, is, is in deep recovery mode from this past weekend. Mm. Sunday was just like, was just out of nowhere nuts. Went to go protest um, down in Dolores Park and SF was meeting point. Went around for a bit, and afterwards there ended up being this uh, impromptu, uh, like, giant dance gathering that happened outside of uh, the studs' old location where they had painted over the building. Um, and so people were just like climbing the the, the fire escapes and just tagging up the, the entire place. It was I've never seen th <laughs> that much stuff going on in one place. I was just like passing by it on the way home too. Dang. That was nuts. So that sounds intense. Yeah, it was. That's crazy. I mean, like, I, I, I'm super into the idea if, if it weren't for the, the whole pandemic thing, you know. Mm -hmm. that, that was, like, the only thing. But I did see, did see like, everyone wearing masks, so I I've love that. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, so that's fucking sick. Well, looks like... But holy shit, what a time to be alive. John, player three, spell table, is going first. I went, All right. I opened up bettings. Does everyone keep... Well, we're going to go and see if people are going to keep their hand. Yeah. And we'll get rolling. Oosh. Am I keeping this? Didn't something new release recently? Didn't something new release recently? You can say that any day. Like it's yeah. probably right about a magic right. set. Didn't we get like a new set come out this week or uh, last week? Or oh yeah, core set twenty one came out last week. Gosh. And jumpstart packs. Yes, right. Um, so jumpstart packs came with buying a box, I believe, and then jumpstart's officially releasing in a week or two. Fun. Yeah. I just want my little bones. I want tiny bones. Gosh. Please. Wanna get home? Yeah. I, I wonder how many players are actually gonna be getting these cards, because a lot of people are out of work. Uh, yeah, it's, I don't know what the situation is really gonna be. It's kind of hard to predict. Yeah. But, eh, I don't know, it's still managing to be. Oh, and then you've got old uh, double masters coming out. Oh, yeah. Gravy. Like, I think Wizards is trying to get as much money from people before the hard times start. <laughs> yeah, right? It's yeah. like, oh, but you've got a little money. We, you could buy an, a Double Masters premium pack, right? Uh huh. It's it's I'm kind waiting. of funny. We have I'm waiting a, for Triple Masters. Triple Masters. Yeah, we're gonna hold after that one too. Uh, we have a local game store that's, um, I guess, very honest about how those things work. And so I, the one thing that struck with me, because um, they still been making pretty good sales as far as Magic stuff has gone. Okay. But but like when it comes to the prize support stuff that they haven't been totally instructed on how to um, to distribute when it comes to pre-release boxes. They mentioned that Wizards doesn't really accept the new reality of, of the situation that we're in, and that kind of makes sense. Like, how are you supposed to like really figure out how to dis distribute prize packs for a pre-release you can't do? And then, in other places, it's still going on, unfortunately. So it's like... I, I think it's better off to hold off from those things just to be safe, and I wish that the company would would uh, would propone that a bit better mm -hmm. instead of encouraging these events to happen. Uh, let's see if we're keeping this hand. Yeah, fuck it. We we can produce three mana eventually, so I think that's okay. Awesome. <laughs> well, looks like everyone's ready. To keep him, John. When you're ready, player three. Let it rip. Alrighty, Danny. Hmm. Very exciting. Did the creek and pass. Ooh. Gonna play a forest. Tap it for a font of fertility. It's basically a green wayfarer's bobble. It's an enchantment. Sacrifice it. Search my library for a basic land. Put in the battlefield tapped. Mm -hmm. Pass. Good card. Yes. Okay, let's play uh, Cable Coilos. Pass. Uh, blood Crypt, untapped, Blood Soaked, pass. Ooh, that's cute. 
<laughs> I will do a pivot crag attack. Uh, two life from me. Oh, Ooh. gotcha. Let's do and then I will play a preordain. Put that over there. And that's a uh, scry to then draw a card. Um, Witchcraft. I'll take the big <laughs> smashing creature and pass my turn. All right, well, that's not foreboding at all. And yes, J3, we didn't. We did describe <laughs> our decks already. Surprise. Surprise. Um, let's do a fucking mountain and pass. Uh, not even just a regular mountain, a fucking mountain. A fucking mountain. Uh, let's oh, no. oh, I could do that instant speed. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> I'll, <do it. laughs> I'll do it now. <laughs> <laughs> all right. <laughs> getting, getting fancy on us, huh, Dale? Yes. Uh, tapping two for a Demir Signet and passing the turn. Untap up to you, uh, play a myriad landscape and blood soaked will come and add. Well, we're gonna go in order of Johnny's. Uh, horse father. All right, all right, I'm taking the two. Uh, pass turn to John. You made a very lethargic enemy, my friend. Lethargic enemy. <laughs> Try it. <laughs> Alrighty, I will. Play a regular, not fucking mountain, <laughs> and go ahead and get the command arena out. All right. And pass the turn. Would you like me to bing bong? Untap, upkeep, and I'll draw. Cool. I'm gonna play stomping grounds tapped. One, two, three. I'm going to play a Cultivate. Search my library for two basic lands, put one on the battlefield and one to my hand. And I'll pass. Okay. <clears throat> doing green things over there. Yeah, green thing, doing green thing. Fetid Pool comes in tapped. I'm going to tap three for... Uh, I'll cast my commander. Uh, I don't want to get beat down by the Bloodstone Champion and the Jora, so maybe not. Um, instead, I'll just play a Commander Sphere. And pass it's the turn over. Commander. All right, go ahead. Draw. Play a plateau. Craft the myriad. Uh, what's Jorah's stats? Two two. Uh, I'll swing at uh, you, John. I'll take it. So I know. Takes two or how much? Two. Boom, boom. All right. Uh, pass turn. Let's go champion doing work. Oh, I gotta get two of the same name. Color time. Oh, she just swaps. Okay. I'm going to do scary things, but not for four turns, potentially. Hmm. Uh, tap in four for two abilities. So I'm glad uh, I put an all from eternity. I'm going to... Suspend a path razor of Ulamog. And then I'm going to suspend an Emrakul. The oh, promised end. Pretty spooky. They're so cool. And then I'm going to pass the turn. Alright, incoming spaghetti. Incoming spaghetti. Yeah, I love this one. <laughs> I always forget about that being the new notification sound. <laughs> like, what's happening? <laughs> Is this death? <laughs> Go play planes. And, um... And let's... One, two, three, four, four five. I'm gonna play Trap Jaw Tyrant. Trap Jaw Tyrant has an Enrage, it's a 5-5, and it, whenever it deals damage, exile target creature and opponent controls until Trap Jaw Tyrant leaves the battlefield. Whenever it's dealt damage. Uh, yes, it's dealt damage, sorry. Yes, you're good. Not deals damage. Gotcha, that's the old ring one. <clears throat> okay, cool. Uh, are you done for turn? Yes. Gotcha. Show. Huh. Hmm. 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 All uh, right, mm -hmm. I guess I better start building a board too. Um, for five, I'm going to cast a Mesmerizing Benthid. 
Uh, whenever e at ETBs, I create zero two uh, blue illusion creature tokens with whenever this creature blocks a creature, that creature doesn't untap during its controller's next untap step. Cool. And it has hex proof as long as I control an illusion. So let's make two little zero twos and I'll pass a turn. Dun -dun. Let's go. You want a blank one? Uh, I got two right here. The show. Thank you. I'll put on card cop. Uh, I'll tap two. Uh, ooh, actually. Play a mountain. Tap the blood crypt and the mountain. I would like to play Molten Echoes. FBI, open up! Oh, oh my Mr. god. Mr. rating with a party of seven. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Bevers. I, I need to know these, what these alerts are before <laughs> I have another heart attack. Dude. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> uh, no, uh, DLC Brandon is actually going to be here like in about ten minutes. He's right. making me a cake. He made you the cake. Now he's transporting yes. the cake. A la cake boss. He doesn't live that uh, far. It tells me something happened to that cake. Oh no. <laughs> I want to choose human. And uh, as Molt Echoes enters, I choose a creature type, human. Whenever a non-token creature of that enters the battlefield, I create a token that's a copy of that creature. It gains taste, and I exile it at the beginning of the next end step. I'm okay. going to tap my plateau, cast uh, Sarah's in it. Oof. Make a token. Mm hmm. They're five Something. fives, right? Or six sixes? Six sixes. Or six sixes. With, life with life. Uh, flying and lifelink. And the token has haste. Fun. Gonna go ahead and swing in at. I'll swing in at the uh, Jara. Ooh, I'll take it. Six flying. Woo! Boom. All right, life and six. And uh, I guess I should also swing in with the uh, blood soak that you because he can't block. So two more. Yes. All right. Uh, in turn, this gets exiled. Last turn. It wasn't originally on the docket, but it seemed really good. <laughs> Boom. Tick these guys down. Draw myself a card. And I'm going to go ahead and hope I don't die by the time some of this stuff happens. And I'm going to suspend a Lumog's Crusher and a Nezahal Primal Tide. Nice. Sweet. We have problems. <laughs> Potent potentially. Our children have problems. We're fine. <laughs> yeah. Social security will last. It's fine. Yeah, maybe. Um, pass the turn. Just That's do why it I think Dora is so funny. It's like, I mean, it's 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 realistically not that bad, but it's just such a giant looming threat over everyone all the time, and they get scary. <laughs> yeah. But realistically, it's not that it's not that bad. <laughs> not that bad. Mountain. Fucking mountain. Fucking mountain. One, a two. I'm gonna play Siege Horn Ceratops. It's enraged when it's dealt damage. Put two one one counters on it. It's a two two. One, two, three, and I will play Colossal Majesty. At the beginning of my upkeep, if I control a creature with power four or greater, I draw a card. All right. And let's. Uh... Do you have any blocker samurai? Sarah Senate six six. Oh dang. I forgot you attacked with the token. Mm. Why don't you swing over here, Dale? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> it's got it's got little jellyfishes. This jellyfishes look. All you gotta do to untap your creature is piss on it. <laughs> mm. No, I'll pass. All right. I don't want to anger John. I feel like he's got something cooking up. He does have yeah. something cooking up. <laughs> I know it is right there. <laughs> Uh huh. Would it be EDH if a single Rissic study weren't played? And cast Rissic study. Mm -hmm. It's a free rip, is it? No one has to go. EDH game. 
and then two uh, for a sigil starfish. Sigil starfish. It's uh, zero three with a tap to scry one. Little buddy over here. Oh. All right, uh, I'm just gonna pass a turn. I'm not doing much over here. Just chilling. Nezol is a rustic study, right? Trigger where he draws when people cast spells. Uh, yeah. Non-creatures, I think. It was uh, non-creatures. Oh, okay. Yeah. Gotcha. So, Mr. Grimora. Gotcha. Tap one, two. Did you drop my Colossal Majesty? Oh, did, is it for everybody? Is it, wait, is it for everybody? Oh, no, 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 no I no. meant for me casting. Uh, oh, no. You did, that. you did that before the study. Okay. Yeah. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, so Hall's not out yet. Yeah. Oh, uh, okay. That's right. Night's Whisper? That's right. He's All right. still suspended. Two, draw two. You're going to pay your taxes, my friend? No, I'm going to bribe you. Okay. Uh, Sounds oh. fine with me. DLC, I'm turning 30. <laughs> <laughs> this I'll play uh, the Sacred Foundry. I'll take two. Okay. Tap one, two, three. Um, I'm going to cast uh, Gideon Blackblade. Uh, he's a 4 4 creature as long as it's my turn. Uh, with indestructible, uh, prevent all damage that would be dealt to him during my turn. Mm -hmm. Up to, I can uh, tick him up to have one creature I control gain my choice of vigilance, lifelink, or indestructible until the end of turn. And then I can minus six him to exile target non land permanent. Ooh. That one is killer in the little uh, arena cube. You know, that I'm mono gonna... white meme actually works to your, to your advantage there because white's so open in the little arena cube. It's actually really, really good. I'm gonna tick him up and target my Sarah Ascendant to give it vigilance. Fun. Fair. Always. And balanced. <laughs> um, I will attack. Um... Not a John. Not a John. Uh, I'm not a John. I will attack Dale for uh, six here. They don't have. None of thing has reach, right? Nah. Okay. I'll take six. six. And two at John. Don't two at me? Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, I'm going to block it with the Mesmerizing Benthid, the 4-5. Uh, spell table, not Johnny Horsefather. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> One, two, I'm tempted I'm tempted to block just because Jura is worthless now, but I won't. All right. Two more. I'll gain the spell table. Um, Pass turn. All right. Take all this stuff down. This is the most annoying part. <laughs> all right. Draw myself a card. Play myself a land. And I will spend three to play uh, Paradox Haze. Ooh, and what that just says that I get to have two upkeeps. Ooh, that's good for this turn. Next turn. No, it's next turn. I mean, yeah, I'm, I mean, like, because next turn is gonna go them all. No, just some of them, and then, and then pass. It's gonna be a no. <laughs> Grumbling over there, Dale. I'm trying. <laughs> Upkeep. I have a five-five, so I draw a card. Fun, and I draw from my draw step. Fun. All right. I'm gonna play forest. Hmm. You know what you have, have to do, Dale. Do you guys have any creature cards in graveyards? No. Nope. None here. Negative. You know what you have to do, Dale. You gotta swing in now. Doesn't matter at who. You can even kill me right now if you want, but you gotta do it. You know. I have to do it. Dirty 30, Dale. Time to be dirty. Yep. I'm going to tap out for eight. I'm going to play Gisha. Oh, he's doing it. Sun's Avatar. Any responses? Uh, do you pay your taxes? Um, I can't pay my taxes. Okay. That's how it... uh, I might have one. Okay. Uh -huh. 
Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna counter. Sweet, okay. I have to take a... Oh, no, never mind. I just use a charge counter. So you pay two blue, and this costs one less, because Jura is a wizard. Nice. And it's a wizard's retort. Counter target spell. Gishath goes back to the command zone. All right. Well, we'll go to combat phase. I'm going to swing at John for seven. <laughs> I'll take it. Uh, I need to learn how to make friends. <laughs> don't, don't one, don't play Eldrazi. All right. Let's untap. Did we find a land? No. Oh, I don't know what a land is. Uh, let's pay two for a birth of Miletus. Uh, first one actually actually useful. Let's be search for a land. Surprise. I haven't done that in years. I'm going to get a basic planes, I reveal it, and put it in my hand. And then I'm going to put a strand on the battlefield. I really like Jorah of the Gitu because she reminds me a lot of Elizabeth from Bioshock Infinite. Just the pulling pulling things from un different universes. Huh. Didn't uh, consider that angle. Dimensions. I like that. You can see it. All right, slapping a planes on the table. Well and Zen. Mm -hmm. And then what do you? Gisha. Mm -hmm. All right, so there's there's an onslaught of, of awful things happening in this next turn. What do we do? Only two of them are happening. Only two of them are happening. Now that's enough to be a little scary. Mm -hmm. Let's. Remember, you can counter them. I yes. can. Because they're being cast. And I certainly have counter spells in hand, so I don't have to worry, right? Yeah, right? <laughs> you play blue. You have counter spells. <laughs> Always. 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 All right. Um, fuck it, man. <laughs> I mean, I'm not really doing much, I guess. I'll just play a, an Orzhov Signet, and then afterwards tap three mana to cast my commander. Lost my commander. Or Don't worry, I'm I'm definitely holding the force of will in hand. <laughs> Draw a card and put a card from my hand back on top. Uh cool. And then pass the turn. If only we could figure out what that card was. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh yeah. Show it. <laughs> <laughs> Keep, uh, draw. Oh. Oh, I want it. But, what I got. I'll play this Hopefully. Palace. Uh, one, two, three. Four. This. For uh, Smothering Tide, you can draw. Thank you. Um, tap um, two for a Goblin Bombardment. I'll take up Gideon to uh, give Sarah Ascendant Vigilance. I will go to combat and I'll just swing uh, 8, 10 damage at a uh, spell. Bubble. Bubble. Oh, Mr. Gunspell table. That's 8 damage coming through. That's a lot. <laughs> Sorry, while well, you think of the blocks, <laughs> there's a little surprise that came through. Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh, that's cute. Thanks. For celebrating the day you became a man. Oh, I'm officially a man now. This looks really good. Gotcha. Go ahead, blow out the strawberries. <laughs> <laughs> Just hold the lighter yeah, up to really it. That's, that's awesome. awesome. Oh, Thank you so much. Between the layers started oozing out <laughs> because of how much damage. That's how you know it's good. 
That's how you know it's legit. He jammed the jam. So we're going to cut you guys slices of cake and whatnot. Yes. Thank you. Uh, Thank you. But as you can see, it's very tall. Yeah, yeah. it's stacked. That's All right. That's very sweet. Thank you so much. About the Bring height of an Ultra Pro deck box. <laughs> about, well, it's taller than my Ultra Pro deck box. About the... Yeah, that thing's fucked huge. All right, starting to drop you guys. About the size of this Dasani water bottle. All right, uh... You need my address for that cake or what? <laughs> we'll send a slice. We'll Don't you worry about that. Preserve. Uh, you gotta block uh, what, Jor? Um, yeah, I'll block whatever the biggest one is that I can block. Well, you can block the medium one. I'll block the medium one. All right. I'll take it. So, um, so how much get damage on my turn? Um, see. So how much damage is coming through? Uh, should be eight. Yeah. I'm gonna gain six. Gotcha. Next, Oof. we'll go ahead and, uh, hmm. uh, pass her. Okay. This looks so good. Yeah, I hope you, uh, have a good Hmm. <laughs> so, I'll do two upkeeps. Nice. And if there are no, you got if it. If there are no, no responses, then pass Razor of Ulamog and, uh, Ember Cooler coming out. It's happening. Uh, Ember Cooler is not very fun over webcam. I don't know how you guys handle that. Um, or... Yeah, that's when we're going to figure right. out. I suppose uh, uh, for whoever you try to control, we can show you the the cards and we're going to have everyone look away whenever you need to see whatever whatever it is. Mm. Um, I don't know. We'll, we'll figure it out. Mm. <laughs> okay. Mm. I guess I'll pick uh, whoever has the least cards. That way it's easier. Okay, let me see. I have uh, six cards in hand. Yeah, got six in hand. I got four. Two. All right, I guess it's Samurai Dancer. Right. We'll, I'll be taking that turn. Thank you so much. Uh, You'll be drawing it. Oh, this had Vigilance. That's right. Uh, yeah. Um, and then I'm going to pay five for a cauldron of souls Ooh. Uh, when you drew for your turn did you pay two no sweet i uh, get the treasure yes yes i'm also collecting taxes on your cards <laughs> yep yeah you get cast triggers on the after they come out of suspend as well i, I do. think that i do thank yeah. you um and then i'm I've never actually played Cauldron of Souls before, but I'm pretty sure I can just tap it now and give my creatures persist. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can do that. Until, it's until end of turn, I believe. Yeah, so I'm gonna do that. Okay. And then I am going to swing at Mr. Samurai Dancer for 20, uh, math, 22, What's that? with Annihilator. I wish the red velvet came out like strong. Uh, uh, yeah, Annihilator 3 as well. It's really Annihilator strange. 3? Yeah. Mm. Okay. Yeah. When we were making it, I, I was thinking that it was going to be a little bit more tame. Sorry, and but as so we started, like, making the from scratch, we started taste testing, and we were like, oh, no. It's so powerful, I love it. I feel like 34 is pretty okay. Or what? what is it, 21? There's 22. Man. Yeah, I forgot you had so much life. 32. Uh, 22. Uh, that's what I'm going down to is 32. Oh, right, yeah. Yeah, that didn't even really do a dent. Jeez. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of regret my decision. Well, too late now. Um, I guess. I guess I'll pass. Alright, so that's 22 damage. And yeah. um, he did an Annihilator trigger, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay, yeah. perfect. Mm. Alright, cool. Um... And so, for Emrakul, do you take his turn now, or is that after? I believe it's my next turn, and then I get an additional turn. Gotcha. Perfect. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. Looks like Dale's up. Oh, all right, all right, all right. Dale's up to oh, bat. Do <laughs> you pay two? I draw for my trap draw. Uh, smothering tide triggers. Do you pay for any of them? No, I have them. Sweet. I'm going to play a Bountiful of Promenade. 
Green. Green. One, two, three, four, and a five. I'm gonna play myself a Zendikar Resurgent. Woo! Whenever I tap a land for mana, add one additional. That's oh wait, did you um, did you pay? Uh, you drew right. You didn't pay uh, two for the two draws off the cast, right? Nah. Ooh. Forgetting these mystic triggers. Yeah. They're so beautiful. Get your stuff. Yep. Also drawn. And I will pass that. Oh, actually, I got to swing at someone. Um. Mm. Yeah. Uh, spell table. Are you gonna swing at me next turn? I wasn't planning on it. No. Cool. Then we're gravy. Um, I'll just pass it. I have not taken my mouth off that cake the entire time. <laughs> <laughs> If anyone would like some, please uh, send us your email address and we'll send some over. <laughs> send it via email. <laughs> we'll email them the cake. All right. I'll take your plate if you want. Oh, thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Thanks. This cake is giving me so much really power. Good. The power cake. Power yeah, cake. Mm. All right. All right, what do we do in the face of all these scary things happening? Uh, do you pay for the treasure? Sorry, Probably not. Right? Yeah, I'll pay for the treasure. Okay. Oh yeah, I'm also create a zero four wall from my birth of Miletus. You don't have to pay for the treasure, because I'm taking this next turn. Oh no, you deserve all the mana. Don't worry about that. Okay, so let's make a zero four wall. I love to make things that do nothing. Okay. Wall. Zero four. I'll draw it in, in a second. Okay. So we're doing a whole lot of nothing. Now what do we do? Something. Hmm. Something, huh? But nothing's that. I guess we will be kind of dickish, maybe. Um. Okay, so I have an idea. Have an idea. Mm. I'm gonna cast a High Cliff Felidar. It's a 5-5 five, five for the Vigilance, for 7. Uh, when it ETBs, for each opponent, choose a creature with the greatest power among creatures that player controls. And destroy those creatures. Fun. Fun, 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 fun. All right. So it just pops one creature? It pops a creature for each opponent. All right. Um, right. I'm going to respond for value's sake. No, don't uh, do that. I'll sacrifice the uh, Sarah Ascendant to a uh, Goblin Bombardment, and I'll target your little girl. Oh, all right. <laughs> Down to three. Three loyalty. Monies. That was a bad touch from the good monk. Do we have any other responses before this uh, little cat goes off? Negative. All right, cool. So uh, choices are pretty easy. Looks like for Dale, we got the Trap Shaw... Trap Jaw Tyrant. Um, and Samurai Dancer doesn't have anything I can see. Nope. And uh, let's see. Greatest Power, that's going to be your path. Is it Ooh, Emrakul or Path Razor? Okay. Emrakul. Em gotcha. Okay. All right, cool. Uh, so that happened, and I think we're going to do it one more time for good measure. Let's blink it. All right, blink it, and going to go for your Path Razor next as well. Okay, so after that happens, we should have a pretty clean board um, for most people. I'm going to move to combat and swing in at Samurai Dancer for four. What? I'm at 32. It's so low. Why, why the pick <laughs> on? Right? People have been picking you. I'm picking on you the entire game. How dare I? <laughs> all right. Um, I think that's all I can do. I'm going to pass a turn after I discard down. Right. To... So I'm controlling you this turn, right? Yes. yes. So it looks like you're controlling Samurai Dancer this turn. Um, so how about we, we turn our heads in incomplete ignorance. We don't know what's going on over there. And y'all y'all confer about this. 
another slice of cake, John. <laughs> All right. All righty. I uh, took those away. Sorry, oh, buddy. Right. Oh, both of them? Yeah. Like, are they yours now, or? No, they're they're just dead. Oh, okay. I'm cool with that. I keep my non-creature stuff, right? Yes. All right. Oh, I can see your hands, John. Oh, oh, never mind. I'm, yeah, I'm, don't look, don't look. Okay, I'm not. I just, secret, secret things are happening over okay, there. Sorry, I just put the headphones on. <laughs> All right. I mean, I don't want to do anything with those, so just. <laughs> yeah, you can just put those away. <laughs> you can just put those away. Yeah. <laughs> um, uh, I don't know what to do here. This was like a bad choice all around. Like, <laughs> I, very, I very much regret like my last two turns. I just got excited to play big things. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That's all right. Um, oh. All right, I guess I'm going to use oh. all the treasure tokens. Okay. Just for fun. Just I'm going to float them. <laughs> okay. And we don't have any creatures, right? So. Nope. There's not. Not really anything I, mean, I can do. Some creatures. <laughs> oh man, this was bad. Okay, I'm just gonna <laughs> pass. That was part. <laughs> that was oh, the my. worst, worst <laughs> use of that card ever. Man, that was definitely <laughs> the worst Emmercool I've ever seen. Oh, it's man. like trying to Emmercool something that doesn't have a brain, mind slavering <laughs> something with no mind. <laughs> uh, that's like when Brandon did bribery on my budget deck. <laughs> Black. White mana with Opal Palace, and I'm gonna cast Ruinous Ultimatum. No, don't do that. That's bad. <laughs> What's it do? Destroys all non-land permanents my opponents control. Fuck. Taxes. <laughs> all right. You're gonna, okay. you're gonna be that guy. Okay. Well then, in response, right. I'm gonna tap this T2 for four while I send a card resurgent out. Is anyone? Oh, sorry, John. Did you have responses first? Negative. Okay. And I'm gonna beast within your smothering tithe. Seems fair. Uh, do you want to let uh, Johnny draw that? Yeah, Johnny draw and beat him up. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna describe one from my my starfish first before it gets completely annihilated. All right, uh, we're gonna put this on top, um, and then I we'll draw it. I didn't clear your monsters. Your creatures were cleared by Johnny. You just cleared my mana doubler and my card draw. So all permanents, all oh, that's so much. My way to come back. So it was an accident. Johnny it knocked me down, you like stomped on my head. <laughs> all Good right. John. Goodbye, little buddies, little starfish. Good job, John. That's fucked up. I really hurt. <laughs> I thought he was just going to cast it on my turn. All right. Back to five mana. Perfect. All right, that's it for your turn, right? Uh, yeah. Okay, cool. Just got. I mean, one. this works out well for me because now I have two big bad creatures. Pretty good, I gotta say. Pretty good. Works out well for me too because you said you wouldn't attack me. <laughs> that's true. Yeah. So let's beat these fuckers up. <laughs> uh, I guess. I uh, I don't know. I'm a little conflicted. I'd like to point out Johnny's at thirty-eight. <laughs> yeah. Is. What are your What are your two enchantments do over there? Um, one lets me sacrifice creature. The other lets me make copies of humans that come into play. If I get a legendary legend rule, will not allow uh, interference before I have to sac a legend. So I'll, I'll have to just choose which legend I keep. I Eight still. Dies I, or look. I still not. feel like like you've done the most damage to me. Plus, there's like too many Johns in this game. So I'm going to come at you. I'm going to come at you for 15 Annihilator 2. Alright, I'll stack a treasure. Uh, and... If you want the foil cake, Pyrovok, you have to wait till WotC releases the Secret Layer Cake Edition. Secret Layer Cake Edition sounds pretty tasty. Alright, down to 17. <laughs> it's just a food token. Right. You taking 15? <laughs> yeah, I mean, not much I can do. Okay. Feel really hard with this game. What did I do to you? Besides the beating, <laughs> <laughs> attacked a lot. Thank you. Besides the beatings, still up on that. Uh, yeah, that's it for me. All right. Oh, did do you do a annihilator? Yeah, I sacked yeah. two. Okay, sweet. On top, upkeep and draw. Huh. I get to draw for non-creature. 
bells now. That's cool. Um, so we're cool, right, John? You're not going to attack me for next turn? It's your birthday, right? Yeah, it is my birthday. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> At all. So for four, I'm gonna play Sky Shroud Claim. Search the two forests, put them on the battlefield, untap. I'm gonna draw a card for that. Yes, you will. I'm just gonna two, two basic forests. Okay. It's happening. It. Cool. Um, I was debating taking Molten Echoes out. Green. One, two, three. I'll play a. Actually, let's do this first. One, two. Three, and a four. So I have these on tap. All right. I'm going to play Harmonize. Draw three cards. Sure. I'm going to draw a card for that. And I'll just stick with what I want to do. One, two, three. I'll play Ranging Raptors. When Ranging Raptors is dealt damage, I may search my library for a basic land and put on the battlefield tapped. All right. And I will pass after that. What are you going to do with all that land? You know, you're going to pass some of those lands over here, I buddy? Mean, okay. <laughs> oh, man, what happened to your Johnny? I don't know. I don't know. Something Seems ruinous, almost... I'm sure. Something ruinous. <laughs> Something ruinous. I'm going to gain a life from my dismal block water. <laughs> <laughs> uh, kind of. Mm. I forgot that was the name of the land. I thought you were just yeah, calling me too. <laughs> uh, dismal, <laughs> yeah. Dismal <black> <laughs> it's really, <laughs> really sticking to the theme and the mood here. Um, going to cast a ravenous chupacabra. Nice. Taking a land, taking a damage from my land over here. Good. And I'm going to chupacabra the the Eldrazi you got there, buddy. Nice. What is that, dude? Wait, hold on. I got a response. Sure. It's uh, when Ch Ravenous Chupacabra ETBs destroy target creature and opponent controls. I'm going to ionize the counter the target spell. No! Ooh, nice. And ionize. You, and you, and you take fucking two. dissipate the Chupacabra, turn it into an electrical current. Expecting Zap it. my face with it, and I'll take two. Jora needs to Injury to insult. Answer. All right. Um, um, well, shit. <laughs> I'm gonna have to discard down, discarding a Brago King Eternal passing turn. Uh, draw. Now, John, you know I didn't mean anything by that uh, that ETB <laughs> kill spell, right? <laughs> oh no, you've only killed all of my fun Eldrazi so far. I'm not holding grudges yet. Mm. Good, I good. Feel like I'm glad we're on good terms. <laughs> I'm going to tap a four, and I'd like to cast Palace Jailer. Cool. I like Palace Jailer. Does it resolve? Oh, I guess. It's a Monarch ETB's uh, O-Ring. And whenever uh, Monarch changes possession, then the creature comes back. Oh, okay. I'm cool off what that. You feel that? Um, I'm going to get two. Um, I'm going to get a Molten Echoes trigger. To make a copy of him. Nice. I'm gonna target Nezahal with the copy. And your uh Eldrazi with the original. Good play. Are you saying that they die? Uh, they get no, exiled. they're gonna be O ringed under the Palace Jailer. And so once he loses Monarch, they will come back. Please, please oh, stop it. Monarch please stop. Why does everyone hate my big bad creatures? <laughs> 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 Why does it everyone hate Annihilator? It seems unnecessary. <laughs> I mean, yeah. it's he's, got, he's got tokens for him. Come on. Yeah. I gotta commend you, John. The answers you had were pretty uh, dang clutch. They were great. Eldrazi Titan. Um, 
we'll go ahead and attack you for uh, two, because I feel like this is bullying Johnny at this point. <laughs> All right. I'll attack you, John, for two. Oh, you know what? Actually, uh, yeah, it's for two. You don't want to attack and me for two? I was debating it, but uh, I'll still give you a land. So that thing has haste, too? Yes, the token has haste from the Molten Echoes. Play Saxa in the turn. Correct. Well, I will do nothing because I have nothing. Cool. All right. Down to 11. Main phase two, I'd like to tap two and cast this Arcane Signal. And then I'd like to tap two. And with Raid, bring back my Blood Soak Champion. I get a token copy. And I'm going to sack both of those. I'm going to... What's your uh, little raptor at, Dale? It's a 2-3. Okay, good. So this won't kill it. I'm going to start sacrifice target it so you get two more plants. He's going to ping it twice. Oh, ho, thanks, bud. Bribery. Bribery. <laughs> <laughs> Don't go all Smeagol with your birthday. Go all Smeagol with my birthday. <laughs> <laughs> um... I'm going to move to my instep and draw a card because I am the monarch. All right. This is the point at which Jura fizzles and I don't do anything until I die. Uh, I guess I'll just like play a tapped steam vent. Oh, um, your as a whole will never come back at this point. There you go. No, okay. Because there was a token that got exiled. Great. Uh, uh, he spanked you pretty good. Yeah. Okay. I guess I'll just uh, pass the turn. Passing. <laughs> Actually, I don't think that yeah. one. I'm not sure if that one works that way because I know that's the fiend hunter, fiend hunter with the second clause. Um, I think past the other, if you lose the monarch, he'll still come back. I I know for a fact that it doesn't because when you blink it with Amanatu. Um, it goes. I actually tried to do that before, and it turns out that's wrong. Um, it's it's uh, it's only Fiend Hunter where you can do that. Once you, once you have the, um, once you lose the mark, it, it's still gonna come back, even after you blink it and have a new instance of it coming in. Are you oh, get the judge oh, IRC in here. <laughs> okay, actually, yeah, I'm gonna wait off this because this might change things for John, right? Okay. Go ahead. Oh, really? Okay. Boom. 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 Upkeep a little. Let's play a fucking mountain. And let's try this again. Huh. One. Two. Three. Four, five. Oh yeah, I'm wrong on that. Six, okay. seven. I, I thought the same thing eight, for the longest time. Nine, ten. So for ten, I have three left untapped. I'm going to attempt to cast Gishath again. Fuck! I can't do anything about that. <laughs> Why would I? Cool. So it, it resolves. Yeah. Awesome. I'm gonna move to combat okay and I'm gonna swing both guys at Johnny hmm uh, for nine damage all right well let me do all right uh, do your uh, little cool. dino thing first Gishath, when Gishath deals at least has vigilance when he deals damage reveal that many cards from the top of my library put any number of dinosaur creature cards from them onto the battlefield and the rest on the bottom of my library in random order all right seven popping off with two dinos <laughs> hey <laughs> Here's one. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, well, yeah. We got two Total dinos. damage. I forgot about that. But, I mean, not bad dinos. You got Runic yeah. Armasaur and Zakama. Not bad dinos. I do not get the untapped trigger from Zakama because... I had to cast from hand. Yes. All right, but I'm still taking nine to the face. Mm -hmm. 
I love it. And, uh... Get your car into a bridge. Four. And I will pay three for Zakama's green ability, destroy target artifact or enchantment. I'm gonna destroy Samurai Dancer's thing that makes an extra token of humans. That seems about right. And I will pass. Runic's Armor Swords abilities, whenever an opponent activates an ability of a creature or land that isn't a mana ability, I may draw a card. Gotcha. <laughs> Alright, let's untap. Yeah, we always think during the tide that matters. Command Tower, uh, cast the most expensive growth spiral ever. Uh, temporal Mastery, take an extra turn after this one, and then exile it. <laughs> <laughs> exile it, untap, draw. <laughs> uh, no, I don't. No, I, do, I do have a 3 beast. Sorry, what was that? Oh. I have a 3 3 beast. I forgot he beast within the, yes. the uh, time. Oh, yeah, that's a, correct. That did happen. Uh, oh, boy, Irrigated farmland comes in tapped. Now what? Now what, Johnny? Now what? Uh, let's play a Knight Captain of Eos. Um, I don't know, let's, let's play. No, it still works out. Cool. I have enough mana. Okay. I think. Yes. Okay, so Knight Captain of Eos. Uh, when it comes into play, I'm gonna put two one one white soldier creature tokens into play, um, and I can pay white and sacrifice a soldier to pr to fog. Nice. Prevent all damage dealt this turn. Oh no, I can't swing it now. And so, gonna create. Does it say all combat damage? It's uh, all combat damage, right? Okay, cool. Yeah, cool, 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 cool. not too bad. Still get your little go goblin bombardment shenanigans, so that's okay. Um, so, I'm going to create two 1-1 one, one soldiers, and I'll also be casting a Talisman of Hierarchy before I pass the turn. Alright, my turn. On the top. Okay. Draw. Hmm, bait, bait, bait. And Runic says whenever someone activates an ability of a... Creature or a land? Yeah, that's not a mana ability. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Now, I mean, they don't could draw cards. That's not the worst. Doing math, doing math. Um, Alright. So... Four. Uh, five. We're gonna cast Silvar. Uh, Devourer of the Free. Nice. Um, I'm gonna go to combat, and I'm gonna attack Spell Table. Or. Seven. Uh, okay. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. Down, down, down. All right. Bing, 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 bong. Bing, bong, bong, bong. Bing, bang, bang, bong. I'm going to sacrifice uh, and deal one damage to uh, Dale. My face? The beast start. Gotta start chipping a little. I'm gonna tap one and cast this blasphemous act. Ooh, nice. Alright. Did All right. you deal th one damage to me or three damage? One. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna respond to the blasphemous act by sacrificing the palace jailer and uh, blood soaked champion to Silbar. Uh huh. So, Dale, you'll get to draw two cards. All right. Nice. Okay, I get to draw two, and I get to tutor for a land. All right. Ooh, so that's reasonable. Oh, he came in with a... Did he come in with a token? No, he didn't. I overtapped for that. Goodbye, little buddies. 
Alright, goodbye friends. Okay, I'm gonna do my tutor trigger first. And then I'll tap one, two, and I'll bring back Blood Soak Champion with Raid. There we go. That'll be all. All That's right. Humans. Live to see another turn. Ah, da, 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 da. I don't have anything to do. Deploy an island. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm going to do the thing that Johnny just did. Wait. I'm going to pay <laughs> seven to draw a card. All right, I love it. <laughs> With a temporal mastery. Beautiful. Take my next turn. Wow. This is not good. Uh, okay. I guess I'll just pass the turn. Your turn, Dale. Sweet. Perfect. Pull buddies in effect. Um, gosh, I did not like that board wipe. Boom, boom. On top. Bitch. What are you gonna do, Dale? Something sinister. Oh, I know. you got board wipe, right? Huh. <laughs> oh, you got a land off the board wipe. Yeah, yes, exactly. I, I got a land and I drew two cards. He hooked you up with three lands. Can't be mad at him. I even let you draw cards off that. Exactly. Good Who's point. the real bad guy here? It's you. Probably me. <laughs> it's probably me. We're just friendly cannibals. They signed up for this. <laughs> what is it? You ever seen that? Uh, you ever seen IT crowd? Yeah, I love yeah. that show. The cannibal where they keep <laughs> teasing the cannibal. It's like, oh, I, I thought, I don't really want to be eaten. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Three for three mana. I'm gonna cast Elemental Bond. Whenever a creature of power three greater enters the battlefield under my control, I may draw a card. Cool. Uh, one, two, three. I'm gonna play Death Gorge Scavenger. When Death Gorge Scavenger enters the battlefield or attacks, I may exile a target card from a graveyard. If a creature card is exiled this way, I gain two life. If a non-creature card is exiled this way, Death Gorge Scavenger gets a 1-1 one, one till end of turn. I'm going to exile Brago. Okay. And I gain 2 life. Brago. And I draw a card. Brogo. Brogo? Is that his name? Brogo. Yep. He, he's got the, the, the Budweiser. I'm going to pay 2. I'm going to pay 2 gonna play a marauding raptor creature spells i cast cost one less to cast whenever another creature enters the battlefield under my control marauding raptor deals two damage to it if a dino's dealt damage this way marauding raptor gets plus two plus zero until end of turn oh that's gonna be fun mm -hmm. oh that's a sad song oh no it's not a sad song one two three Four, five, six, seven with the dollar discount. I'm gonna play Polyraptor. Oh, all right. One, uh, two damage gets dealt to Polyraptor. I get another Polyraptor. Oh, are you gonna fucking go infinite right now, Dale? Is that what's going on? Can I? I don't I, think so. Um, I, I think it does. Oh shit! It does. <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> Surprise. Oh no. Oh, no. <laughs> Okay, I get three. I get three. I get, yeah, you can have three polyraptors. I get three polyraptors. I don't give a shit, personally. That's it. <laughs> Just three polyraptors. Uh, oh, yeah. That's actually... It, it would be indefinite, and yeah, it, this game would just tie. It'll just tie out the game. But uh, what's your red dude's uh, defense? 2-3. Uh, 2-3. Two, three. Two, three. Damn. Well, actually, it gets... Uh, now, I guess it's a uh, 6... Uh, Four, actually, eight, three, until eight. end of turn. 
And, and why is that? Is that because of the scavenger? If it's a dinosaur, it gets plus two, plus zero in turn. Oh, it would just keep getting super fucking huge. Yeah. Holy shit. But it doesn't have haste. Also, um, your elemental bond. Oh, yes. I get to draw four cards. One, two, three. You know, actually, you know that what's funny is four. if you were to, to do this, oh, you would actually, actually die. Elemental bond isn't optional, is it? Uh, no, because I draw, I mill myself out. You you just killed yourself. <laughs> but our house rules say no infinite combo. Three iterations. So we're I'm an okay. optional. I don't know, Dale. I think I'm you just okay. killed yourself. <laughs> I think you just got yourself, Dale. No, I did it. I did it. <laughs> uh, birthday boy made an oopsie. I did it. Um, I'm gonna discard down and pass. <laughs> <laughs> My goodness. <laughs> I like I like the chat right here. It's not a may. Take the loss. <laughs> <laughs> you, you played yourself, Tail. Yeah. I mean, you know what? I'm I'm, I'm going to be I'm going to be gracious and let you have that for the one time cuz I got a terminus and get perfect. fucked. Oh no. <laughs> All your shit goes to the bottom of your library. God, uh, so many board that, that, wipes that, that, this game. That, that, was, that was your one birthday take back. It's not oh, dying to the polyraptor bullshit. Uh, Although in spirit, you did. Right? <laughs> that would have been insane. Uh, I'll stack the, um, my two creatures to the bombardment. Okay. What are you picking uh, with? Deal, uh, I'll deal two damage to uh, eh, Johnny because you made me do it. All right, sure. <laughs> Oh my goodness, that's fucking funny. Wow, that, I didn't even recognize that combo. That's pretty great. Thanks, Phantom. Thanks, Gridden. The, the human one is optional. That one isn't. <laughs> no, it's really funny. <laughs> that's amazing. Alright, I'm a not to. The thing is, a draw, except you had the elemental bond, so it's, that is just suicide. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Normally it would be a draw, but this time you just, you really die. I love it. <laughs> Five. Uh, grinning what happened to John. John played Eldrazi's card spells and people got mad at him. Alright. Most, or, uh, mostly five. other other Johns got mad. Yeah, the other Johns yeah. were jealous. Healthy <laughs> I was very jealous, yes. Alright, let's do that. Let's put a card from my hand on top of the library. Do it like that. I'm, I'm the good guy left here. over. Um, I'm going to play Act of Authority. What's that for you? When an ETBs, you may exile target artifact or enchantment. At the beginning of your upkeep, you may exile target artifact or enchantment. If you do, it's control yeah, yeah. against control of it. Uh, so let's do that. I'm typed out. I'm going to exile... I do like Bombardment being out just because it gets people little zaps. So I'm gonna exile the element. elemental bond. Cool, I got my Saved hand. I'm good. All right, I'm passing. <laughs> We're saving you from yourself, Dale. <laughs> <laughs> my own worst enemy. <laughs> Is my oh, stuff still exiled forever? Uh, until I'm not the monarch. Yeah, once he gets punched in the face once, it comes back. I'm holding on pretty strong on that though. <laughs> he just need, uh, he just needs a little tickle. He just needs a little tickle. Do. One. I'll keep uh, draw. Hmm. All right. Uh, I'm surprised there's no meme called Juan Punchman. Juan <laughs> Punchman. <laughs> Punch I gotta start drawing cards. Uh, I'm gonna tap one, two, three, four. Uh, play Ishi Specialist, naming human. All right. To Two, three, four. I'm gonna cast uh, Jarena Kudro. I create a one-one human soldier for each time I've cast my commander from the command zone this game. Once. Sure. Get a one-one. Other humans I control get plus two, plus zero. Oh. Sweet. Best turn. Uh, P for is I don't at the moment. I'll have one probably by the end of tonight, though. Grin asked, did you guys all net name or what? 
What's with this John shit? <laughs> yeah. Net name. I, 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 Net I googled this name. I'm sorry. They, Counterclockwise. We get stronger Johns. <laughs> John's the meta name right now. It's just, yeah. It's John's well, it's right, meta. It's right below Muhammad for the meta, for top tier. Oh name. yeah, that's right. <laughs> for top tier name. You're welcome. <laughs> uh, I ended my turn. I got the draw card. Woo! Because I'm still a monarch. Oh, I get to go another turn? Yeah, you're I keep, alive. I keep thinking I'm dying, gonna die. Like, I haven't done anything in three turns. <laughs> Very impressive. Fact. We're gonna keep you right. alive till we regret it. <laughs> Alright. Very um, happy. Man, <laughs> I really can't draw anything worth a damn. Oh no. Uh, no. I guess I'm gonna uh, just do a Hail Mary here and do it. Do it. So, what do you got to lose? Big money spell table come through. Let's get it's it. not a not really a Hail Mary. I'm just gonna look at the top four cards in my library. Put <laughs> okay. them in my hand. See. I'm very excited about those cards. You got me really hyped up about it. I love it. <laughs> the impulse real quick. <laughs> uh, uh, why? Oh, that was the hype card. Remember that? Everyone was like, that's gonna be the great card. Impulse. Oh yeah, yeah. The this is pretty more, right? Right? Did I hear that correctly? Uh, will or whatever? Yeah. No, nope, a braid. That. <laughs> <laughs> Braids were what, $7 at a time? Yeah, now it's like 30 cents. Alright. So it's, no. it's not a bad card, though. Right. I like it. So, I'm going to keep digging because I picked a ponder. Heck yeah. Picked upon so, the ponder. Pick look at the top three cards and put them back in any order. Draw a card. Where did you use your rainbow lands for that? Uh, I don't know. One of them was for a counter spell earlier. That's what, that's what no, the yeah, yeah, I think one was for. for that. Not using the counter, but just instead of tapping the basics. Right. Uh, I mean, I don't, nothing in my hand will make a difference. So, no mages to the moon. Uh, this sucks. I'm gonna. Sh so, there's an option on ponder where I can just shuffle? Yeah, yep. you could. Uh, so, this, this is how bad I'm digging. Oh, man. <laughs> the problem is, like, everything in my deck costs, like, 100 Hold mana. Up. And I'm out of shenanigans to, like, uh, hey, wait four turns. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Who has the most mana right now? Probably me. Yeah, definitely you. Perfect. Okay. I finally got something I can play. All right. Unfor unfortunately, it's a swift foot boots. I'm going to pass my turn. That's legit. I was really hoping for the other Blasphemous Act to come 11, through. 12, 13, 14, <laughs> 15. I'm pretty sure I have one in here. We need okay. a couple more of those. No, it costs five mana. That's right. That's true. <laughs> Not quite up there yet. <laughs> That's all right. He's, he's got six more turns left in him. So untap. I keep on a drew already. Sorry. Um. Click clicky. Hello. Good to see you. Click clicky. How's w Wiki doing? How are you? I'm gonna play Command Beacon and I'm gonna sack it to uh, put Gish in my hand. Oh, you treacherous bitch. Ha <laughs> ha, the treacherous bitch. It's me, Dale, the treacherous bitch. One, two, a three. I really One, like those, two, like, archaic insults. Three. There's something about them that just really that tickle me a little bit, you know. I like, I like treacherous, that's a good one. Cool, for eight. I like scoundrel, that's also a good one. Two, three, four, <laughs> five, six, seven, <laughs> eight, eight, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep. And uh, I need to have one more. Eight. Gonna play out Gishaf. Any responses? Nope. Cool. Cool. Big Dino Go. Dino Go. Right. And then. Or John. How big are your creatures, John? <laughs> uh, my creatures, uh, four, three, three, one, and a three, three. 
Alright. Just do one damage to One, two, <laughs> the three, four. Oh. I gotta tap this differently. You don't have to. Oh, I don't. Oh. There we go, this is it. Like so. I'm gonna play the four mana. I'm gonna play uh, Needle Tooth Raptor. The Needle Tooth Raptor is dealt damage, it deals five damage to target creature and opponent controls. Okay. Bountiful Promenade's gonna be my green. One, two, three. I'm going to play Miri Weatherlight Duelist. It's a 3-2 first strike. When Miri, Miri Weatherlight Duelist attacks, each opponent can't block with more than one creature each combat. As long as Miri Weatherlight Duelist, Duelist is tapped, no more than one creature can attack in each combat. And I'm going to swing at... Yeah, I'm going to swing at Johnny for seven. At little old seven. me for seven? Sure, sure I'll take seven. Cool. Gish ass trigger for seven. On board wipe dino. One, two, three, four. Son oh. of a bitch. Ah. Five. Yes. Six. Seven. Dang. Only got. Regisaur Alpha. And Majestic Heligiltopterus. Other dinosaurs See, I control have haste. And when Regisaur Alpha enters the battlefield, I create a 3 3 dino token. Alright. These guys are going to bomb the library. Um, I will pass after that. Oh, that was commanded. Yep, you're good. Yep. Um, I'm taking my commander damage. One more is, hit and I'm dead. That is beautiful to know. One more hit and you're dead. One dead. more hit my dead. Uh, I have an upkeep trigger on active authority. Yeah, let's just go ahead and, um, and exile the goblin bombardment. And then you're going to gain oh. control of this enchantment. I will respond. I will sacrifice the human token to deal one damage to John, because it's a little funny. <laughs> I'll draw a card <laughs> off uh, one damage uh, species. Uh -huh. And I'll let the bombardment go and I'll get your active authority. All right, so you have the active authority. Um, let's see, draw for turn. Get the blinker. Cool. Yeah, put it on the side. Okay, draw for turn. Oh, shit. Um, miracling. Oh wait, no, doesn't matter. Okay. Come on. Okay. Miracling yeah. entreat the angels. Miracle trigger. Am I gonna cast it? Oh, Holy shit! Fucking scared of Dell's board and shit. You should be. Only block with that. All right, no, I'm not gonna cast it. <laughs> not gonna cast it. After that, you should be. I am. I'm gonna plus one Amanatu to draw a card, put a card from my hand on back on top. Let's do that. Jeez, what is it? What could it be? What could be back on top of my deck? Nobody knows. And treat the angels. Eat shit, Dale. Massacre worm. <laughs> Massacre germ. It's oh, another board wipe. <laughs> Get wiped, Dale. So it's just. What does it do exactly? So, uh, when Massacre Worm ETBs creatures upon- Oh, shit, I fucked up. <laughs> yeah, you, you ticked out Bominatu. You're Fuck. supposed to blink Worm. Fuck! You're only getting minus two. <laughs> Damn, alright. No. Is What's up? Oh, no, oh, yeah, I just realized that now. So when ETBs creatures your opponent's control get minus two, minus two until end of turn. Whenever a creature an opponent <laughs> controls is put into a graveyard from the battlefield, that player loses two life. Okay. That's so the wrong six. number, bitch. Oh, fuck, man. That one was so tight. <laughs> only minus two. Oh, wow. Did he actually kill your, some of your shit? Yeah, oh, yeah, three things. I could have killed wow. two more things. You know, it would have been a little spicy. But that's okay. If you did your dude, yeah. I hear that voice. <sighs> fuck. Fun, 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 I'm fun. so mad. All right. Uh, I screwed myself again, too. Another way. Shoot. All right. I'm passing the turn. <laughs> Full of rage. Vinegar and rage. <laughs> <laughs> Draw. Um, okay. I'm gonna tap one. I don't, might as well do it this way. I'm gonna tap one. Uh, Soul Ring. Let's see. Uh, do -do -do -do. 
let's go ahead and start ending people. Tap, um, uh, um, let's go ahead and just move to combat, and I'll attack with, uh, Jarena at, uh, at John. E? For damage. You mean John E? No. <laughs> For how much damage? Three. Three. In response, I will equip my swift boots to nothing. <laughs> but I. Dang, that's rough, John. Recipes, my sweet friend, John. This is what happens with the Jura deck. It's like it comes out strong. People are like, "Oh no!" And then it's like, "Okay." Oh yeah, that's that's like die. the perfect example of, of playing with Jura. That's exactly what happens. I know how it feels. <laughs> man. It's, there's a reason why we have that cut out for Jura's because I used to play Jura. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna cast uh, Silvar, uh, Devourer of the Free. More. I'm gonna tap two and bring back Blood Soak Champion with Raid. And uh, I'll end my turn, draw a card from the Monarchy. All right. My turn. Sweet. Untap. Upkeep. And I will draw. Believe in Dale. Oh, that's a fun one. Let me count out my mana real quick. Oh, I gotta play a new one. I'm gonna play a uh, Sun Petal Gate Grove. Not even said gate. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, counting 16. Counting stacks over there, Dale? 16, yeah, counting all my money. Looking at that bar mitzvah land. That bar mitzvah land. <laughs> 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, yeah, I'll play Raging Swordtooth. Uh, it's a 5-5 five, five trample. When it enters the battlefield, it deals 1 damage to each other creature. Okay. I'll respond by sacrificing my blood so champion to Silvar to give him indestructible and a plus one plus one counter. Nice. And I'll draw a card because he's was a human and I'll lose life, I believe, from the massacre one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's got nothing, Dale. Nothing, I tells you. Well, I got a little something. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm gonna play uh, Yendaro, Wandering Monster. It's What's a it do? Um, it's just, it's a cycling card, really. So it's, I could cycle it for one and a red. When I cycle it into my graveyard, shuffle it on the library from a graveyard. And if I cycled it four more times, put it on the battlefield instead. So it's, uh, it's otherwise a, a trampling 8-8. Eight, eight. Yeah, trample 8-8 eight, eight with, with haste. Yeah. Well, all my dinos have haste right now. Yes. It's pretty thick. Uh, yeah, why not? How big is uh, your commander, John? Uh, it is a 5-3 at the moment. Okay. So instead, I will tap 2 and play Sacro Tribe Elder. Uh, Johnny, could you switch my life total up to uh, 15, I think, from that cigar one? Oh, 15? Gotcha, excuse me. All right. So, Dale, question, where's, where are you swinging at this turn? That's a good question, my friend. Um, this guy keeps telling me to get fucked, so... I'm thinking Which about guy? The guy? Samurai? In, the guy in, Why would you do that on his birthday? Um... 
We might have a text before we go into combat. Before we go into the cleric. I'm gonna swing yeah. Gishath, Yandaro, uh, and Raging Swordtooth at Johnny. And okay, that seems cool. Gosh, your other guys are so big, John. Yeah, that's it. I'll keep it at that. Alright. Um, I'll block your commander with Massacre Worm because I have to. Cool. The 6 5, okay, and uh, so two's can trample over. Okay. Coming oh. at me? Pause. Sure. What's coming at me? Um, nothing. I think. Okay. I'm gonna cast uh, Deadly Rollick on the Massacre Worm. Oh no. Oh no! Uh oh, spaghettios! I am, I am just dead. Do 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 do. Cool. I get Gish after seven, right? Holy shit! Yeah. yeah. <laughs> cool. One. R.I.P. Three, four, five, six. Treachery. <laughs> I got a uh, territorial hammer skull and a carnage tyrant. All right. Uh. And I will well, pass after fun. that. I'll be right back. <laughs> Untap, upkeep. Ooh. Does that actually matter? Or would it be better to try and do this some other way? Let's think. Okay. So, how many blockers you got? How many blockers? Five. One, two, three, four, five. Did that. My biggest one's a seven, six. All right, we're going to just go ahead and sacrifice uh, Jarena Kudro to uh, my boy Silvar. Pump him up. Nice. I'll draw a card. That's a good land. Play this bad land. Um, mm. <laughs> oh, uh, did you want me to tell you what the dinosaurs I have do? There's Territorial Hamel School, which whenever it attacks, tap target creature and opponent controls, and I have Carnage Tyrant. Make sure you're fully informed before you make a decision. <laughs> Let's. Um, uh, oh, Gishath is on tap. Sorry. It's a. Uh, I have another blocker. Because Gishath has vigilance. My bad. I keep tapping uh, things. Thank you, Phantom. <clears throat> Let's go for a little broke here. Um. Play the Sky Reach. I'll uh, tap the Soaring uh, Guy Reach Sanitarium. We each draw a card and discard a card. Okay. I want it. Um, I'm going to cast Chainer Nightmare Adam. Nice chainer. Uh, this chainer I'm board gonna... wipe? Is that what chainer does? No. <laughs> Discard. For instance, uh, odd dark mark. So I can cast a creature from grave this turn. I'm gonna cast uh, Jirino. I have cast my commander uh, twice, so she'll create two humans now. Nice. Uh, go ahead and sacrifice one of them. To Silvar, draw a card. Sacrifice another of them to Silvar to draw a card. We'll go ahead and sacrifice to Jarena to draw a card. Cool. Draw a card. Uh, sacrifice to Chainer. To draw a card. Dang. Draw a card. Like a hatred or something. Uh, pure specialist. To draw species specialist to draw a card. <laughs> no. Let's see, and, uh, I'll go ahead and concede. 
All right. All right. The dinos you, came through. What were you looking for? Uh, I was looking for one one tutor or uh, anything to get my living death. Oh, nice. But uh, living death much because you know you got your thing. Mm -hmm. So basically, I was looking for another board wipe. Oh yeah, living yeah. death would help me out tremendously. <laughs> All right, but, uh, so it looks like uh, Birthday Boy takes it. Although, he did draw his whole deck before. I mean, <laughs> look, at house, look at our house rules. Although. That was a great time to pull up our house rules, in case you were wondering why I didn't die that time. I mean, that doesn't even make sense for the context. <laughs> I'll, I'll even read it out Cause, for cause you. Because that, that was an infinite combo. <laughs> All right, welcome to MTG Lexicon, the dive bar of EDH. Right now, we're going to read off the house rules while they get ready. So, number one, turn no turn four or earlier wins. This helps prevent people from playing, you know, CDH decks and whatnot. Most of this was based off of the previous, before the banning, of Flash Hulk. Uh, but it does mean that people get a chance to build their decks up and have an ability to respond to some shenanigans. Number two, no infinite combos. That's right. No infinite combos. You get three iterations of any combo that you have. After that, you are done. You is finished. You can go home. Number three, no la no mass land destruction. Uh, we did this because we felt like uh, starting the game over on turn 15 was just not worth it to you or to us. So if you're going to mass land destruct everyone... You have to win within two turns. If you do not, you must forfeit the game and burn your deck here on stream. Number four, mulligan until you get a keepable hand. That's right. We want you to be able to play. There's no point in you going down to five cards and having a terrible time at everyone else's expense. And we want to see you have fun. So if you don't have a good hand, let's say you get one land uh, and a bunch of garbage, or let's say you get six lands and one garbage card. We want you to kind of throw that away and just draw another seven. Obviously, you don't want to do this until you get like the god hand. We just want to make sure you have something that's keepable. So those are the rules here at MTG Lexicon. We keep it casual, we keep it fun. And as always, we want to see you here with us. Yeah. And uh, Pyro, by the way, thank you so much. You are you're always very kind with that support. Thanks thank you. again for being a baller. All right. Very um, much powered off. What's going on in the world? Are we gonna do uh, one more game? Is that what's happening? Do one more. I gotta run. All right, my friend. Well, thank you so much for joining us tonight. Yes, appreciate you, having you. You really watch. slapped some people up with that little drawsy Ooh, <laughs> before before flawless. the bad times came. Before, <laughs> I tried. I tried. Before the retribution uh, came. Steer creatures. <laughs> I appreciate y'all having me. It's always fun. Yeah. Thanks again. Great having you. Yeah. All right, so yeah. let's see. How, how are we going to do this? Are we going to have one more person step in, or what are we doing? All right, so we'd hold on tight. We're going to figure out um, how we're going to do this next game in a second. We might have someone else joining us in a little bit. Uh, John, before you leave, can you do some shameless plugs for us? Oh man, I think they already did oh, it quick. He's gone. That was my bad. No, <laughs> John, come back. Well, if you're not aware, Spell Table is a service that allows you to play fucking EDH online with your homies. So check that out. Um, a lot easier to do now that we're in, we're in these, you know, very distant times. Dark. Times. <laughs> the dark times. There we go. So check out Spell Table if you want to play EDH easily online with your homies. It'll That's be right. worth it. Spell table is always advancing and adding new things, so listen or at least keep your ear to the ground for new features and new additions to Spell Table. Uh, honestly, it's a great product for people who are looking to just kind of get together on the fly. Uh, we definitely use it here with our off-stream community. Uh, I believe Phantom had a game with uh, John Johnny Mulligans the other day. Oh, yeah. Uh, I heard that was a pretty fun game. Uh, we do do community games here. Um, I think we're going to start trying to do like an open thing online where people can play with us and we use Spell Table as the platform for everyone to just kind of have fun. Uh, go check it out. It's a really great platform, really easy to use, and something that is just absolutely a necessity during these times. Uh, actually, I was in that game with uh, Johnny Mulligan's and Phantom. Nice. Fucking sweet. Oh, nice. Sarah. I forgot about that see the humans first <laughs> <laughs> nice 
That was glorious. That human's deck is pretty great. All right, well, we're going to take a look at what John has for us. Uh, he's got some things for us to vote on while we wait to see if we get a fourth. We're going to jump on over. John, why don't you go through your decks uh, and tell us what you have. And if you have a dice, uh, that would be really helpful, and you can number the decks uh, that you want us to vote on. No problem. Um, let's do three. Nevermore Paint Studio, what's up? We're still looking Welcome for back. a fourth. I don't know if you're into it or not. <laughs> uh, I've got my young, you know, my Yawgmoth Undead Tribal uh, deck. Uh, really fun. Has some real spice. Uh, I always end up casting Army of the Damned and uh, normally end up casting All Hallows Eve. Those are both really fun cards. Uh, Villas uh, has been on this channel before with the turn five win. Uh, that's demons tribal. Uh huh. Uh, we've got humans eating humans, which you guys just saw, and then we've got Atris, uh, <laughs> Atris acquisitions, uh, where I'm just gonna clone and steal your stuff. I think your deck's great, so I would like to play it first. All right, and uh, comment on Army of the Damned because that's actually surprisingly efficient for being a huge spell. Like when it goes off, it I mean brutalizes people. So that's always very dear to my heart. Never. I it really wasn't supposed to be in the deck. It would just end up showing up. So just shows I would, I up and does work. I was like, oh, I, I need exactly one card left. Uh, I ordered this other card. Well, uh, I'll, I'll put an army of the Dan. That's going to be an easy cut later. Yeah. <laughs> Never I, got cut. <laughs> yeah, I think I remember playing against that deck, and you cast it twice, and that did win the game. <laughs> The, the game where uh, I broke the mass land destruction rule, I forgot about that, with the uh, the, the Liliana. Oh, right, that Lily. Yes, I remember that for sure. Nevermore so, Painting uh, Studios. What's her name on our Discord? Anymore. Sorry, didn't mean to interrupt. Eh, it still works. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, as far as Atris goes for the effect, I just show it to camera. You pick one, and then the other two go to grave. I just treat it as everyone should probably know what I'm going to have in hand. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, I was really proud of the humans eating humans. That was just like, it was supposed to be Kelsey and Snipes. And I was like, uh, I was playing with my friends uh, uh, pre-con. Yeah. And I was like, oh, you know what? I haven't. I'll try out each of the commanders, and I found Jorino, uh, Jorino or whatever her name is. Right. Take way too much to get going, and then Kelsian was just so fragile, and it's like yeah. the minute he goes, the deck starts crumbling. And I was like, well, what about this? And beating people down with Silvar has got to be one of my favorite things. Like, just starts adding up. And Trent uh, didn't really make much of a showing this game, but normally that's the. Normally she comes out on turn four and starts and stays out for a bit and generates just a token every turn. Yeah, that's really cool. I think they did a really good job of, of doing what it was trying to do. Even with all the constant board wiping happening, it still managed to have a pretty formidable presence. It has like, oh, let me see. I think it has like about five board wipes and I'm always thinking about adding another. I, I like Mardu because it's like got the most removal in my opinion in the game. The yeah. most efficient removal. Yeah, I think you're right about that. <laughs> no one wants to see Phyllis. <laughs> <laughs> oh, poor Phyllis. I like Phyllis. Yeah. By the way, so you're using a four-sided die, and I cannot see what the fuck number that is. It's always going to be the top number. I know, yeah. but how can I see that? I it's mean, right there. process of elimination, my friend. You've been to school, right? <laughs> no. <laughs> Both of you know I never finished high school, so... I mean, you've been to school, though, right? <laughs> I mean, I slept through <laughs> school. A test. Whoa, 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 whoa. You're giving me far too much credit. <laughs> my man. Where of school? Uh, yeah, it looks like Atris is going to be up. More than enough. Pyrovok, another gifted sub. You're a monster. Oh, man. You're a monster. <laughs> Not the gumdrop buttons. <laughs> that poor gumdrop button. Um, all right. Let's get out of this uh, four player thingy. Uh, the ball. And uh, we're just going to do Cool. Oh, well. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and start a poll for my decks real quick. Sure. I'm gonna grab some water. Perfect. I need something to 
keep me nice oh. and fresh. All right, guys, gonna have a bet for not bet. Holy a shit, it's a lot of decks. Yeah, nine <laughs> decks. Um, I'll go and describe these decks in full. Locust God, number one, splash red. It's basically mono blue as a Taloran deck, but I wanted some win cons that aren't boring, so I put in about four or five red cards to win. Tuvasa the Sunlit, hate Bear Enchantress, just Voltron as well. Just put a bunch of Bant enchantments. Lord Windgrace, Landfall Punish. Well, uh, Saturday it was the last deck I played. Um, just get a bunch of lands and play big mean spells. Recoup two reflections, big mana, copy spells. Names itself Poop Shit Squad. Uh, Grenzo, Dungeon <laughs> Warden, the original Poop Shit Squad. Just put out a bunch of goblins and do some aristocrat effects with them. Some Poop Shit? From Poop Shit. Varamos Dragon Engine featuring Gigantha. It has Gigantha as my 101th card, aka Companion. Um, I modeled this after Thanos from Infinity War. So basically, I just get my Infinity Stones and I. My man! Yes. Um, <laughs> number seven is Moldrotha the Grave Tide. It's Voltron Mutate. It uses Mutate and Moldrotha. Don't need to say any more. Um, Ukima and Kazur, it's a Voltron Infect. About three Infect cards, but. Mostly it's from hatred and just I pump up her up, pump up Akima and just blast people. Nice. And Pyrovok, again, thank you for more subs, man. You're out of control. <laughs> also, Johnny, would you like to play with one of my decks? Sure. Fuck it. I'll, I'm down. Maybe we can vote on what deck uh, Johnny should play with after this. No, nah, I'm just going to select it. You're going to select it? All right. What do you want? We're doing it. Um, let me see. What, what we got on you right now? I mean... All of my major decks except for Vona. Vona's right there, but um, she's in development. Hmm. Let's do. Oh, that's not it. Dragons is dragons are. I want you to play Jalira. I think you would have fun, Jalira. Jalira is actually pretty yeah, sexy. Okay. Sexy, stupid. Shalom, gentlemen. She's like if uh, Tara Reed was a deck. <laughs> <laughs> Just be nice to it. That's all I ask. <laughs> when you finger it, I want you to go slow. That's it. Gotcha. I'm very gentle with this deck. That thing costs yeah. one month of rent for me, oh which, my God. if you know how much I pay for rent, that's quite a bit. Oh, my God. Now I'm scared. Can I do Mizzix? No, just, know, just, no, do just do play with that. Taxes. Just be nice about it. That's it. <laughs> yeah, just, oh, man. Just do it like has is on. It's like no, cool. upside down. Oh, yeah. Oh. I, I'm, I'm so scared. <laughs> Dale, I'm gonna build Lord Windgrace because really I'm probably There's a my, fucking uh, thumb slot right there. The turn, turn. Windgrace is oh, fun. Go. He's so versatile. I'm, I'm getting uh, my chains of Mephistopheles in, oh, and I'm gonna, gonna make uh, oh, Windgrace together, uh, dredge. That's a really strong oh, magnet. That's yeah, it is. Uh, I think uh, Johnny has a chains of Mephistopheles, right? Uh, no, I don't. I really wanted one. I have another void. Oh, we're, oh, that's right. That's right. We were looking at it. Yeah, I remember being extremely jealous seeing that. And someone has the abyss. Is it? Uh, is it Jeff? Uh, no, Jeff doesn't have the abyss. I don't think anyone in our group particularly has the abyss. Maybe. Oh Paxton. no, I think um, no, no, no. Um, I think Roger Grinnin might have it in oh, one of his decks. Fucking sick. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah, the only thing else I can think of is P3 has a tabernacle of Pendril Veil. Vale. He does have a tabernacle. Oh, I remember seeing that. that he also has a chains. Tight. He does have chains? Okay, yeah, that's right. That's who has the chains. Nothing's as big as a flex as that uh, Gravity Sphere or whatever. Oh, Gravity yeah. Sphere? That's the, the red card where we just lose flying, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's the one. It's interesting how, how well Boros lands itself to, to being prison colors. Back in the olden days, because you had that in moat, so you just couldn't attack at all. Mardu is just like the ultimate prison deck. That's why I think they need more jailer cards than Mardu. Yeah, Mardu's uh, gross. Mm -hmm. uh, he's gonna be playing with Jaleer. Yeah. I'm oh, that's someone cool. else right now. Oh, sorry. You got those. You got what is it? Mephitic vapors. Isn't that the one that? When Lethal creature... vapors. Oh right. Hell I'm yeah. thinking about the other Give one. All the turns. Yeah, lethal vapors. You just go to Fairy's Protection and go, oh, I'm just going to pass here. <laughs> yeah, you can do a lot of dickish things with that card. It just lends itself to it, and I love it. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Uh, when I, Every time I talk about it, everyone's like, ah, yeah, whatever. But whenever I play it, people absolutely fucking hate it, and that's Ether Flash. Yeah, it's a fucked up card. Yep. 
Aether Flash will get you the, the punch. There's a lot of decks that really fucks over. Mm -hmm. What is it? Is this two damage, right? Or is it three? Two. Two, yeah. And especially if you have Torbran out. Oh, boy. Good day. Oh, yeah. Torbran is fucking oh, Yeah, you're doing with four to every creature instead of two. Yeah. I mean, even then, there's still, like, you could still, let's say you're doing Boros, uh -huh. and you decide to do that, and, like, um, what's her face? The Proctor? The pro oh, yeah. Like, either Academy Rector or... Um, Fucking. Uh, arena Rector? Yeah, Academy Rector or Arena Rector as well. Yeah. Those two. <laughs> instant. <laughs> the proctor. Sorry. It, it, instant, like, like uh, enchantment or instant, like, you know, planeswalker. Either or are just unaffected by uh, Ether Flash. Right. Ooh. Oh. Or there you could put out that. Elish Door. Right. So they take two and then they lose an additional two. DC, yeah. The DC. Card's good. Card wait, is wait, good. is that a Croxla deck? There we go. I have four options once again. Cool. I am going to close this. It's going to. Ooh, it's a tie between Moldrotha and Ramos. I vote Moldrotha. I haven't seen Moldrotha in a while. Sure. Moldrotha and Mutate sounds fun. I'll pull out Moldrotha and do that one. My man! Pyrovok. Man, it just. Absolutely on a tear. Holy shit. Thank you very much. Wait, let me my man. You're putting my dick through college. Thank you. You're putting my dick through college. Holy shit. You're putting Dale through college. <laughs> Dale's an extension of my dick. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yes, it is. Family studio. My man. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right. Nevermore. What would you like us to call you? Either Nevermore or my name Calvin. Calvin, all right. Where's Hobbs? <laughs> Hobbs is dead. I buried him in the desert. <laughs> my man. Sorry, I get asked that exact oh, question yeah. a lot, so I have an instant response to it. And the fucking cheer, thank you. <laughs> yeah. Thank okay, you. I get asked for the I John. decided to go for the <laughs> even two hundred gifted. But yeah, so I have wow. Four Holy options. shit. For shenanigans. Um, I gotta send you a special present later. Uh, Calvin, give us one second. We're gonna Same pull. The, we're gonna put the pull up on the stream. Just give us a second. If you can number them with dice, though, that makes it a lot easier. I did indeed. Okay, They're, cool. It's not flipping. Uh, yeah, you gotta unlock it. I did, I think. Yeah. yeah I You're doing player three remote. Oh nope, wrong one. Thank you. All right, Pyro. So uh, uh, let me think on it, and uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna figure out a little present to send you. Two hundred is. I see is already someone wild. Very excited for Croxa being out. Yeah. Hell yeah. All right, we're gonna put up the poll for you, Calvin. Can you angle your camera just a little bit more um, towards your up? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Just now a little bit down. A little bit lower. Oh, too but, far. Oh. Yeah, a little too far. Oh, yeah, awesome. Yeah, yeah. A little bit more. I, I mean, I really love the 40K, okay. but all right. Okay, now, just was... literally a smidge after that. You're getting my, well, my dick you, pretty hard here. There we go. Oh, yeah. Perfect. Right there. Right there is oh. perfect. All right. Looking good. And move the cards to oh. your left. Oops. Okay, let me just go. There we go. Time. Beautiful. So. Hey, thank you for the follow. Uh, four cool. options for <laughs> shenanigans this lovely night. Our Croaks of Discard, it's the deck that's the most resilient to anything anyone else does because it really doesn't care what happens. It's just going to keep eating cards until it dies. Mm -hmm. There's Jorian, Ruin Diver, Cantrip, Tribal. I'm going to draw. That's the point of the deck. I'm going to draw everything I can find. Uh, Sadisi Brood Tyrant is a reanimator value town deck. Vertical. I'm going to play a uh, Terastodon for two mana, probably. I don't know. Wow. It's happened every time I've played the deck. And then there's AR, first the Lock Thwain, uh, Mono Black Combo. That's Combo, horizontal kind line. of. Oh, we'll do the horizontal one. There you go. Sorry, you can keep going, Calvin. But yeah, <laughs> it's a Mono Black Combo Value Town. I'm going to play a lot of black creatures, and in case you can't tell, there's a theme to my decks, which is incremental value hmm. over time <laughs> it's the, i don't like the big single whammy at once uh -huh. i'll just grind people down which is why i like these decks um yeah 
Calvin, now that we've got you all centered and squared away, can you now move them to the right? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh, perfect. Oh, I love it. Sorry about Watch that. The nation's gonna it's come and block them again. Oh my! I guess people like the Kroxa. Yeah. I mean, he is—he's way cooler than his brother, you know, Euro. Definitely. Yeah, that's for sure. Gosh. Standard got it wrong. Kroxa was the better brother. Another oh, Tad, my hungry boy. Let's see, two minutes and very overwhelming support for the hungry boy. The boy who hungers. The, the hungriest of boys. Oh, also, a uh, quick show. Uh, I've got Olivia's stuff because she's amazing. Uh huh. And That's I have good. Nessa's stuff because she's amazing. Sweet. Nice. Check That's that out. Fun. Check them out. So support both those streamers. They're amazing. Well, we're Fuck at yeah. Calvin, do you have any shameless plugs for yourself? Hi, I sometimes stream me painting stuff. It doesn't happen very often because I'm bad at streaming. But hey, if you want to see me vaguely paint models like this guy right here in progress. Yeah, look Death at that. Oh, wow. It's okay. Check me out on Twitch when I'm painting various things. I sometimes post my stuff on the Discord. Yeah, very clean work, by the way. It's okay, oh, Calvin. You. We're bad at streaming, too. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. That makes all of us. We have something in common. Four years, <laughs> no one knows who we are. <laughs> Surprise. Let's see. What do they do? It's more of a you. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Whenever we meet it's in the street, they just like lock eyes with us. It's you. <laughs> <laughs> the Kill Bill. Oh yeah, the fucking Kill Bill sirens. <laughs> oh, let's see. It looks like there's been an overwhelming support. Uh, hungry, hungry time. It's the hungry, hungry hippos. It's the hungry, hungry, hungry time. Boom. Ouroboric Forum says, I paint my nails and I can't stay within the lines. I feel that. I feel that, my friend. It's not like I've been doing this for six years or whatever. <laughs> because, oh no, that's just a coincidence. <laughs> Um, John, are you keeping uh, the same deck? I'll keep this hand. Oh no, you're playing Atrus. Where the hell did I put no. my deck box? Oh god, John. Yeah. <laughs> Questions <laughs> that get asked. <laughs> oh, I threw it across my bed. Interesting. I'm gonna keep the sand. Okay. Got lands on. Let's see. I don't open the bed here. Open up the beds. Oh. If you bet on me, I'm sorry. Let's roll four. He goes first. Player two. That's a samurai dancer. Sweet. All right. So I'm gonna check this Let's see if I can draw a decent hand out of this deck. Uh, just so you know, the lands here are completely mismatched. <laughs> I'll play uh, turn one ponder. Oh, I, I, I didn't even... I'm not, we're not keeping... We didn't do mulligan yet. Oh, hold on, I've been producing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sure, slow down there, boy. Uh, there you go. Uh, these guys don't name themselves. <laughs> yeah, they do. I'll draw. Uh, your turn, number one. Um, are we just rolling? Like, already rolled. Out. Life totals aren't shenanigans. Like, oh yeah. Well, yeah. let let's start off and do this right. So we're gonna go around the table. We're gonna introduce ourselves. We're gonna talk about our decks, and let's read off some lore or some uh, flavor text that's at the bottom of the card. So we'll start off sure. with player one, just to keep it, you know, standardized. All right. So I'm player one. I'm Johnny Horse of the Deluxe. Um, I'll be playing uh, Brandon's Jalira deck, which is a polymorph deck, hoping to uh, just uh, take some stuff from other players, polymorph into some huge creatures, and punch through people that way. It's also his bling deck. It, things are very, very expensive in this hand. I cannot afford this hand as, <laughs> it's, as it currently stands. Um, and then in player two spot, we have John, a Samurai Dancer. Hi, Samurai Dancer here. Uh, this is my Atrus Steel Shit and Become Shit deck. Uh, basically, it's going to be clones and theft effects. In my hand, we have a wonderful flavor text. 
What would you exchange for a cosmic secret? Any payment is a small price for insight. <laughs> I love it. Very, very flareful. Very, very. Gives me like a hint of human. That's what I'm getting from it. Yes. All right. So I'm playing uh, Croaks at Titan Death's Hunger, Discard, Self Mill, Resilience, and for a piece of flavor text, pain is both tool and a craft. Like any tool, it must be sharpened. Like any craft, it must be practiced. Ooh. Beautiful. I have no idea what it means, but it sounded great. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> How do you spell Croxa? K R O X A. Okay. He is the hungriest hippo. The hungriest hippo you can imagine. For sure. And I'm playing Muldrotha the Grave Tide. It's just a run the mill soul tie um, mutate. It's Muldrotha, so I can just mutate whenever the hell I want. <laughs> and just poop out mutate. Or a bark form is right. You spell Croxa as W I N N E R. Sure. You are incorrect, good sir. I've only ever won on accident. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so it looks like go ahead and play. Wasn't even his final form. Just an old fucking Maltro. Uh... So it looks like John did his turn. Yep. So... yep. The turn one ponder. All right, uh, my turn. Untap, upkeep, draw. I'm going to play a Evolving Wilds, and I'll go searching. Well, I passed the turn. Solid. Perfect. Oof, that was perfect timing, Dale. <laughs> yeah. Boom, boom, boom. Good job, Dale. I'm going to play a fucking forest and pass. Okay. Fucking forest. Uh, let's play an island. Pass turn. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, John. All right, untap, draw. Gonna play this relic tower, tap one, and I'd like to cast the Serum Visions. Nice. Ooh, spicy. Uh, That's a good art, too. Yes. Cry, too. Yeah. Well, I guess one of those doesn't matter. Uh, pass turn. Untap, upkeep, and draw. Gonna play a mountain. Gonna tap two. It's ya boy. <laughs> All right. He enters the battlefield or attacks. Each opponent discards a card. Each opponent who didn't discard an online card this way loses three life. Mind leech pass. Pretty. Ooh. Keep on the roll. You gotta discard a card. Discarding a. Do I? Oh yeah. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Temple of the False Dog and taking three. Mm-hmm. I'll discard a um, Lanoir Waste and I'll take three. Cool. What's up? Okay, um, and then there is no other text on this card at all. I'm kidding, of course. Let's go to the graveyard. Nice. Draw. Faster. Always oh. find it's put in command zone after the first cast. I'm gonna play an island. Tap two play a Maraleaf Pixie. It's a Mana Dork with Flying. Cool. Two nice. player Mana Dork. Mm -hmm. Solid. Alright. Alright. Let's drop a turn. Play a Snow-Covered Island. Pass turn. Play a Swamp. One, two, three. Oh, Mirror Mirror on the wall. Pass turn. Alrighty, untap, upkeep, and draw. Gonna play a swamp. And then I'm going to... Tap three to play Megrim, which had my flavor text. And it reads, whenever an opponent discards a card, it deals two damage to that player. Solid. Fun. Pass turn. Uh, yeah, would you? What was that? You wouldn't happen to the deck list, would you? For mine? Yeah. No. <laughs> this thing's not good enough for me to like actually keep pay attention to what's in it. It's top secret. I'm gonna play a forest. And for 
And there's gonna be a lot of updates I have to do to it because there's like five or six other cards that do this effect or actually probably two or three that I need to add and a bunch of wheels. Cool. I'm gonna mutate my Merrileaf Pixie into a Boneyard Lurker. I could do two oh, green nice. instead of black. All right. Oh, whenever this creature mutates, return target permanent card from my graveyard to my hand. Got my land back. Ooh, Solid. And I'll pass. All right. Island, I'll tap three for Vidalcan Shackles and pass the turn. Ooh. Kinky. <laughs> uh, I'll play a swamp, tap one, two, three, four, and I'd like to cast uh, Solemn Simulacrum. Sad Robit. Sad Robit. Sad Robit. Robit. Island and that'll be all. <laughs> all right. Untap, upkeep, and draw. Oh, things are getting spicy over here, apparently. I'm gonna tap these for a Rakdos Signet. All right. That is pretty spicy. Actually, I'll do that. Then I'll pay into it. Are there any creatures in any graveyards right now? I have a mind. No. Six six with trample. When it deals combat damage to a player, you may look at that player's hand. If you do, you may play a non-land card without paying its mana cost. Oof. Uh, so I'm going to be casting two spells off the mana from this because I'm floating black and a red. Sure. With the black, I will cast Shamble back, exile that creature. I gain two life and I get a two two zombie. All right. This is for reanimation. Zombie, 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 zombie. From my favorite set. Beautiful. Nice. Which is Eldritch Moon, because Eldritch Moon is the best set. It um, is a fucking sick set. You're right about that. Eldritch Moon. And then, with the red that I have floating, since I finished putting my tokens back in the box, I'm going to play the rack. Oh, the rack. Oh, I missed that if card. I if one has fewer than three up cards in their hand during their upkeep, it deals one damage to that opponent for each card fewer than three. Oh. Yep. Pass turn. Beautiful card. Cool. One, oh, no, no, no. Uh, upkeep and I'll draw. Uh, Nevermore, which opponent are you choosing? Uh, it's a po oh, it's if opponent. I thought it was yes, if you opponent. Have to choose one. The... Do you choose an oh, opponent? Oh, if I have to choose one, I'm yeah. going to choose Jonathan. Okay. Wait, what? They're both Jonathan. <laughs> They're both... Uh, Jonathan Samurai. Okay. <laughs> so. I'm not Jonathan. So player two. Player two. Okay. Um. Uh, Jesus or Jesus? Um, it's the card Shamble Back. I thought their name was Jesus too. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna play Command Tower. Mm-hmm. Mm. Reach out and touch me. That's beautiful, Dale. A person pernicious deed in the pass. Pernicious deed? Mm -hmm. Oh, you little fucker. Reach out and touch me. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's play an. His land. <laughs> Remind me what Pernicious Deed does. Oh, Pernicious Deed. I could pay X and sacrifice Pernicious Deed, destroy each artifact, creature, and enchantment with CMC cost X or less. Interesting. And right now I have two untapped mana. Okay. Um, <laughs> let's tap the shackles and gain control of your bone lo boneyard looker. You, you want me to pop that now? I don't give a shit. <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> I'm just gonna pop it down. <laughs> oh, All right. Destroy your Vidalka Shackles. Wait, it's Wait, this is CMC3. Oh, CMC3? Then I won't. <laughs> uh, you, can have, you, can, you can have my lurker. All right. Enjoy it. I love it. Teach it how to learn. <laughs> Teach it how to learn. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll pass turn. <laughs> 
<laughs> Wait, oh dang, I should have tapped it in response. Too late. One more. Yeah. Draw. Um. Uh, How many cards are in your hand? Uh, five. Okay, you're fine. Yeah. Uh, tap two. Uh, Mirage Mirror. I will target uh, Pernicious D. Nope. You're. What happened? It's gone. No. No, he's... I'm making a copy of Pernicious oh, D. Oh, nice. We have two of them. Great. I'm gonna play this uh, island, and I will um uh, attack Dale for two. Okay. Solo, and then I'll move to main phase two, and I'll pop Pernicious D for four. four, four. All right. Damn it. Here you go, buddy. Yay! Into the <laughs> graveyard. In the graveyard. <laughs> <laughs> all right that'll be all a-okay with me all right untap upkeep and draw i'll just wait for the cards here but <laughs> oh yeah i can't I like wait cards. on samurai for that that's, a, that's an okay <laughs> card i'm going to You okay, buddy? <laughs> I'm just so hot and there's so much shit in my way. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. <laughs> gonna play. Air of Falcon Wrath. I discard things to make it bigger. Alright. I can only discard one and it flips into a 3 2 with flying. Hmm. Fast turn. I hate when my ears get sweaty. Just that Princess Deed was pretty clutch, I gotta say. Yep. I like it. Well, if you like having shit in your graveyard. Why? I'm gonna play Mind Rack Harpy. At the beginning of combat on my turn, each player puts the top three cards of their library into their graveyard. Woohoo! Okay. Alright. I know Nevermore likes that. Let's be friends. Um, I'm here to be friends. Cool. Uh, move to combat. Mill three, everybody. Milling three. Also, Grass Rampage. Minimo, Swole at Water's Edge, and a Swamp Covered Land. Sower of Temptation, Island, Command Tower. Uh, Dread Kakro Demon, Hardened Scales, and Ashiok Dream Render. And I will pass after that. Gotcha. Draw turn. Okay. Let's see. Did I skip a land drop? No. No. Yes? No. Going to tap four for Everflowing Chalice with multi kicker. I'm gonna kick it twice, which gives it two Ooh. charge counters. Um, I can add colorless to my mana pool equal to the number of charge counters on it. Nice. So you have two on there? Yes. Uh, that. With that said, I'm passing the turn. That's a nice looking soul ring you got there. Yeah. My four mana soul ring. Your four mana, four mana soul ring. So bright. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Thrawn Dynamo. That's one thing I forgot. Oh, I guess it's my turn. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh. Uh, let's go ahead and play an island. Uh, tap one, two, three, four, five. Oh, thank you. I'd like to cast a, a choir targeting Nevermore. Oh, what is this? Stacy is super loud in here. Hey, listen. Uh, maybe we maybe we should just bring it down. Remind me what that card is, because I don't know what the heck that is. I search your library for an artifact to get into play. If that's the case, give me five seconds. Well, sure. one second, let me show you the artifacts that are here. Just a second, Doug's going to put his face over the AC for a couple seconds, really, like, get himself into the spirit of winter before we shut this off, because I know it's a little bit loud. <laughs> yeah, we have a AC here in the building that uh, doesn't work for us, so we had to go out and buy our own. And we put it in the stream room, so we're running it right now as things are getting hot and spicy yeah. and steamy. So Dale just needs a minute to cool off. No, take your time, Dale, please. <laughs> I want your head cold. You have I, I want to grip it and feel the icy embrace of your 
cool <laughs> forehead, Dale. Sorry, I turned to Macho Man again. Randy Savage on occasion. It just, just kind of happened. There we go. All right. Good night, sweet friend. Uh, <laughs> which of these would you like? Uh, Wayne Ferrer's Bobble. All right. <laughs> uh, yeah, I was, I was not the one to grab for that. Uh, see if you had a guess, Grimoire. <laughs> I'll go ahead. Have, you think I have bobble. money? <laughs> that expensive. Wait, you only have a Wayfarer's Bobble in there as an artifact? That's it? A Wayfarer's Bobble and a uh, Pithy Needle. Wow. Oh, Pithy Needle's a good shit. But I'll take the Bobble. Yeah. And crack it. Great. <laughs> Works for me. Actually, kind of hard to ramp actual lands into mirror. Next <laughs> <laughs> turn. All right. Uh, your end step. I'm gonna discard Nightmare Void to transform air into air to the night. Three two flyer. Yay. Yeah. Three two flyer. On top, I'll keep and draw. Air hey, look, it's a land. You know what that means. Is it a fucking mountain? Yeah. It is worth it. I'm going to exile Nightmare Void, Swamp, Swamp, Angrass Rampage, and Shamble Back. I used to put it my broke, PC sir. in my fridge in college just to keep it cold. <laughs> All right. So we discard from Croaksa? Yeah. Yes. Um... Get a Swamp. I'm discarding Polymorphous Jest. I'll discard Lana Wall Waste again. Or lose three, right? Mm -hmm. Do I want to discard four? No, I shouldn't discard this one. I'll discard this club. Actual club. Actual, actual club. And, uh. Sam right answer. Yes. Three in the air. Kabang. Seems fair. I'm the only one who hasn't discarded land. All right. The bolts keep on coming. And I'll pass turn. Cool. That guy had haste, or did you play it? Are, are uh, you play no, Heir to the Night is the guy transformed at the end of your turn. Ah, right. that's fun. I'll keep and I'll draw. Thank you, Jesus. Um. <laughs> oh, hey, look, my girlfriend's back in chat. Oh. Hey. Welcome back. It's good to see you. Hey, girl. Um, I'm gonna play Overgrown 2 and tap. Uh, one, a two, a three, realistic study. Okay. Oh, yeah. Trying to draw your way out of this one, huh, Dale? <laughs> you can't draw your way. I can't draw my way out of way from my daddy problems. Um, anyways, I'm, um, combat. Mill, 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 <laughs> mill three. Tyrant of Discord. Firewing Phoenix. <laughs> Island, Freaking Island. Freaking Affliction. Swamp, Very Conquid. Monument, and Batter Skull. Uh, clever Impersonator, Mox Amber, and Swamp. Alright. Uh, and I'll keep my blocker in pass. You sure? It's a flyer. You can, you can go punch something in the face. Oh, yeah. Well, I'm friends with Kroxa. I'm gonna punch you in the face for three for stealing my punch dude. me in the face? You sure. All right, you my guy. all right, you, friend. You didn't even teach him how to learn. Dude. <laughs> you didn't teach him how to learn. You didn't teach him <laughs> shit. <laughs> He'll never learn. I'm gonna gilded lotus, tapping like that. Damn that freaking owl. <laughs> <laughs> gilded lotus, and then I will play solemn simulacrum. Oh, I, did you pay one for either yeah. of those? Yeah, uh, Robin. Yeah, I'm not gonna pay one for either of them. Cool. All right. So uh, let's tutor for a land and then pass turn. All right. One tap up to the draw. Woo. Play the swamp. Uh, one, three, tap three. I would like to cast Mnemonic Betrayal. Is that quieter? Mm -mm. Uh, Which is? Exile all cards from all opponents' graveyards. You may cast those cards this turn, and you may spend mana as though any yeah, mana of any type to cast those spells. Beginning your next instep, those cards re those cards remained exiled. Return them to their owner's graveyard. Exile Mnemonic Betrayal. Oh, are you going to pay one for that? No. Sweet. Because I'm a nice guy. Huh. 
You're the nice guy. All right. Um, how many lands do you guys have exiled? One. None. Um, I have a bunch of lands exiled. Let me see. Which land? Exiled or in graveyard? By my graveyard. Oh. But well, exiled from my. Uh... You can cast cards. You can play cards. Cast. So you can't be lands. Yeah. Not from mnemonic betrayal. Yeah. Or something else. Probably. Okay, well, um, in, in Graveyard, I have a bunch. Does it have to be specifically exiled? No. Uh, I exiled your graves. Oh, okay, yeah. Oh, all of our graves? Yes, with the yeah. Mnemonic Betrayal. Uh, yeah, I played sense. this uh, last week. Uh. So, Temple of the False God, uh, Minamo, School at Water's Edge, which is the untapped target legendary permanent for blue. Only cast, so you, you don't need to name lands. Uh, Snow-Covered uh, Island. Well, he, he, he wants it for a different purpose. Um, so, I got, I got three islands in here and a Fairy Conclave as well. Uh, and Dale, what... what you have exiled a swamp and a land of our waste. All right, I'm gonna tap six and I'm gonna cast... sower. Is that what's gonna fucking happen, yeah. Johnny? Oh, you fucker! As soon as I heard the <laughs> the number six, oh shit! Wait, what does Oblivion <laughs> Sower say? Good uh, stuff. I exile the four cards of target player's library, and then that player puts into play all lands, any number of lands that player owns from exiled onto the battlefield under my control. Oh, Ooh. nice. So, top, top four cards of our library? Uh, someone... Target opponent. No, he's got to choose yeah, one. Yeah, he's got to okay. choose someone. All right, who are you uh, targeting? <laughs> I did this to ramp. Yeah, that's, a, that's definitely going to happen. That's a good ramp. Although, spot. actually, does Oblivion Star work here? One second. Or whatever this card is, <clears throat> does it work? Yes, because it's what owl lands they have eggs out. Yeah, at the and, moment, everyone's graveyard is exiled, so yeah. they are all in exile. Yeah, Except for your own. That uh, works all right. <laughs> yeah, um, I'm, I'm going to be a little obstinate and double check on that. Sure thing. Um, all right, if you I, don't mind. I'm sorry, did, did you uh, mill me? Was that what yeah. I heard? Mill you. Okay, let me and mill uh, four cards. Are you paying one for that? No. Cool. That player owns. Okay, so. I milled over another land and a Blightsteel Colossus. So it's going to get shuffled into uh, the library. Well, wait, 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 wait. Because he's putting them into exile, not into the graveyard. Yeah. Oh, forgot. So you're exiling the top four cards. So now you take all the lands that are currently in exile, which is what you're holding in your left hand. Let me see. Oh no! This uh, this is still going to go into the into the library because it's exiling all cards uh, from the moment that he. But cast he only it. gets the ones from the player he uh, he exiled. Shuffles. It would go to grave. Oh really? Okay. Yeah. Oblivion is specifically yeah. exiled. Before. Yeah, th those last four cards do go to the grave because m m not, uh, <laughs> mnemonic betrayal exiles at that time doesn't keep exiling the entire turn. Wait, wait, no, no, no! What, what are you talking about? Exile all cards from an opponent's graveyard, right? It's not the end of turn, so they stay exiled at the moment. Okay, so he casts that first. Now he's casting Oblivion Sower, which says target opponent exiles the top four cards of their library. They uh, don't hit the graveyard at all until the end of your turn, and the ones from Oblivion Sower, right, are different. So the Blightsteel, or yeah, the Blightsteel stays in exile until. But he'll only get the lands from the person. Right, the blight steel stays in exile. It doesn't All ever right. go or touch the graveyard, so it doesn't have its effect. Gotcha. All right, so I'm gonna put these off to the side. There's another island in there. All right. So what were the lands? Just gonna write them down. Sure. Let me see. So there are uh, four islands. Snow covered mm -hmm. islands. Um, fairy conclave, and. Let's see. Fair Conclave, Minamo, School at Water's Edge, and Temple of the False God. Wow, that's a lot of lands that got sent away. Oof, Temple of the False God is a good program. Yeah, so he's getting the Betrayal and the Oblivion. <clears throat> and then um, the Blight Steel goes with the original four. So that's just flat out in exile. Just gone. Yeah. Man, I played a choir on you, Johnny. Yeah. Grab. <laughs> so uh, let me just create some tokens real quick representing that. 
uh, four islands. Yeah, in order for a blight seal to trigger, it'd have to go to the graveyard at some point, but it just doesn't, so. Mo, fairy. And then, temple. I need to get those infinity tokens from you guys. Where do you guys get those? Uh, infinity. <laughs> yeah, they're actually a the company's called Infinity Tokens. Buy them, buy them today. They're really useful for everything, and it would make stuff like this a lot easier to do. Did you guys right. add 15 poison to the house rules yet? Uh, it's something that they have to discuss before the game, just to make mm -hmm. it fair. Uh, you can play this arcane signet. What all spells do you guys have exiled from your uh, graveyards? Um... Shrieking Affliction, Firewing Phoenix, Tyrant of Discord, Wayfarer's Bobble, Rakdos Signet, The Rack, McGrim. All right. Uh, for Dale, you got a uh, Ashiok Dream Renderer, Ronus's Monument, <laughs> Batter Skull, Hardened Scales, Dread Cacodemon, Boneyard Lurker, Merrylee Pixie, and Pernicious Deed. I actually uh, that, that still doesn't work because it, what, what I'm getting at with Mnemonic Betrayal is that it says exile all cards from all opponents' graveyards. That's at that time. It doesn't keep Correct. checking the entire turn to keep exiling things from the graveyard that go there thereafter. Right, but Correct. what that's not that's the issue. Oblivion Sower says exile the top four cards. Oh, it exile excuse me, I thought that you're talking about an Mario Trail again, exiling more cards. Okay, that makes complete sense. That's my bad. Alright, uh, Johnny has a polymorphous jest as the only um, instant or sorcery oh. in his I have no instant or sorcery. It's fucking yeah. I'd like to tap three and cast uh, Pernicious Deeds because uh, Mnemonic lets me play yep. uh, spells though they were any mana. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to tap two and crack Pernicious. For two? Cool. Um, are you going to pay one for the Pernicious Deed? Could you cast all the They come back, Johnny, so separate the ones that you milled from the four oh, originally. Right. These are exiled. And the lands. Yeah, um, and then now remove the lands. Yeah. Does fairy enter untapped or tapped? Does what? Uh, enters the battlefield fairy... tapped. Okay, so I gotta tap an island. Um, I'm gonna... And then uh, Affliction costs one, correct? Correct. I'd like to tap one and cast Shrieking Affliction. Lit. And this signature is gone. So I get two or six study triggers? And that'll be all for my turn. Yeah, I have Mimnetic uh, Betrayal in my Zer deck. Best mm -hmm. fucking addition that I've made to that deck in a long time. Uh, untap, upkeep, and draw. So this gets you back the graveyard? Yep. Pernicious yeah. Steed stays exiled? No, well, he's cut. cast it, so okay. he actually owns. He cracked it, though. I... But uh, as far as those lands, those stay. Yeah. Okay, yeah, he sacrificed it. So wait, yeah. wait. What did you sacrifice Pernicious Deed as a uh, CMC? Two, uh, two. I cracked my uh, arcane signet because that was an idiot. Okay, so you did pernicious deed for two. Mm -hmm. Johnny, you lose your um, your oh, mana rock. Yeah, sounds good. So if you did it for two, you lose the rock, and that's it. Yeah. Yeah. All right. All right, my turn. On top of keep draw, play a land for turn. It's your boy. He back. Gonna play one for that. Yeah, I'm not gonna do anything else on my turn. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Discard some shit. Uh, never more cards in hand for your upkeep? Uh, I had three. Okay, so you're fine. Oh, I have uh, three cards in hand. No, you're gonna discard. Oh, I'm discarding? My bad. Uh, I'm gonna discard a force and lose three. Lay of Anticipation. Goes to the graveyard. Never, wait, never more. You had three at, during your upkeep or during your draw? During my upkeep, I had three. And Shrieking Affliction doesn't care until I have one or fewer. Oh, that's right. It's not uh, think of the other ones. OK. Yeah. I'll take three damage. Woo. And never mind. Trust me. I'll never, yeah. never get that up. So. And Aster? Wait. Oh, wait. Samurai, you said you're taking the three? I have to take the three. I have no hand. OK. There we go. Boom, boom. Cool. Upkeep. I love it. I play, and I wanted to do it. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, draw. Demonic Betrayal. Such a good card! Yeah, it is. But you have to exile it uh, as soon as you play it, which which sucks. There's no recursion of it. You could Narset's Reversal it. This is true. I mean, but why? 
So you could do it again. Yeah, I put it back in hand. But it's a part of the cards. It wouldn't resolve. Sack two so, forests. Yeah. And the play Scorching Ruins. Uh huh. Which says? Uh, when Scorching Ruins comes into play, sacrifice two untapped lands or spare Scorched Ruins. I could tap it for four color mana. Nice. That thing got so hyped with Blood Sun. Yeah, remember that for sure. Mm -hmm. It was on my list for Wind Grace, and then suddenly I couldn't afford it for Wind Grace. Mm. Is, is it still like really expensive? I got it with more drop that came out. It got overhyped. I got so annoyed because it was literally on my list for Wind Grace, and I, was, I literally checked out everything for Wind Grace, and I was like, why is it $34? Right. And then, like, it doesn't really even do anything. It's not even worth the the, the money it was at, so it's mm -hmm. like, fuck. Mm -hmm. Not really. Um, boom, boom, one floating. I'm gonna play Consuming Aberration. Ooh. Nice. Consuming Aberration's power and toughness are equal to each, or each equal to the number of oh, no. cards in my opponent's graveyards. Whenever I cast a spell, each opponent reveals from the top of their library until they reveal a land card and puts those cards into their graveyard. Okay. Um, Johnny has five. Three. Yes. Put a dice representing my graveyard. Thirteen. Eighteen, okay. Solid. Five, thirteen, and three, so twenty-one total. Yep. Useless infinity token. Tell me more, Daddy. And uh, <laughs> combat step mill three. All right. Seedborn muse, parcel beast, and herbor. Chamber of manipulation. Mountain. Underworld dreams. A calm refuge. John, I feel so bad. People are milling away some of the best cards in this deck. Ah, that's alright. Not that bad. And uh, get there. I will pass after that. So add nine to your twenty-one. Oh, nice! Fuck it's thirty. Nine or the twelve because it's, it's everybody, it's just right? Like me, it's yeah, 30. everyone. Huh. So it goes oh, up to thirty. Congratulations, it's only my Dale. opponents, not me. Academy ruins. Um, yeah. Blade and thievery. <laughs> <laughs> the Brandon special. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. For each opponent, gain control of target permanent that player controls. Um, we're gonna take Oblivion Sower. The Kroxa and the Consuming Aberration. Are you gonna pay one for that? Uh, yes. Game. Game. There you go. It's different now. Uh, subtract yours and I'll tell you mine. Ooh, right. that sounds hot. <laughs> one, two, three, four, Taking five, eight six, off seven, this. Eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 for me. Okay. So Difference 20, of eight. 22 plus 16, yep. 838. I got 16. All right. Cool. Great. Um, swinging sad robot over at Dale for, <laughs> for injury to insult. How much? <laughs> two. Two. I'll take two. Okay. Passenger. Boom, boom. I'm tapping massive mana. And you're taking uh, shrieking affliction damage? Is that what's going on? No. Oh, no. Yeah, never boom. mind. How the turn tables. Wow. <laughs> uh, draw for turn. Uh, mm. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Uh, tap temple. Tap one, two. Uh, Crooks is a five, five? Six, six, six. six. I'll cast Atris, Oracle of Half Truths. You gonna pay one? Yes. Thank never. You. Cool, never. Okay. That's good to know. Uh, reveal. I'm gonna target Johnny. Uh, okay, I'm uh, gonna have to flip those around a little bit towards the camera. I can't see them very well. You're, you're upright. So, okay, I see them. Um, so... There you go. This is horribly painful. Okay, so... Uh, put the middle one... Uh, put the middle one face up and the other two face down. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Turn three. Mm. Mm. Yeah, I'll take Bashiok. I don't care about the other two. Sounds Woo! Good. No penalty. 
18 cars engraved now. Plus two. Yes. Thank you. Let's think about this. No, oh, <laughs> oh, okay, I'll do this. Uh, tap. I'll tap five. Uh, I'll tap blue, 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 black. I'll play Ashiok. Sing Ashiok. Uh huh. I'll take it down. We'll go down to two. I'll target Oblivion Sower. So does it uh, flicker or what does it do? Can you read that yeah. off for us? Does it kill something? Non-land permanent to its owner's hand. Then that player exiles a card from their hand. Ah, gotcha. All right. I like my Sower good. back. I'm going and to exile a... uh, Cyclonic Rift. Oh. No, I have deck. Do we each exile cards from our hand? No, just okay. him. Yeah. Creature hey. creature controller. It's Wait, it owner. says creature controller, not creature owner? Owner. Oh, well, then you so, exile oh. a card, not Johnny. Wait. Wait Johnny, a minute. Johnny, don't exile. Uh-oh. Re read that off. Um, which card? Uh, Eshiok? Yeah. yeah, the ability. Target non-land permanent to its owner's hand. Then that player exiles a card from their hand. Oh, yeah. That does, that so Samurai's gonna have to exile the card. Yeah. Well, Part of, all according to plant. Uh, <laughs> tap one, two, three, four, five. Uh, what did you exile? Uh, Myriad uh, Blade of Selves. Oh, okay. nice. That's such a great card. Never. God, I hate that card. I need to take that out. What? It's never. It has never worked as the way I want it in this deck ever. Like it takes so much build up for it. But uh, I'll cast Oblivion Sower and I'll target Nevermore with it. Cast four? Trigger. Uh, exile the top four cards of your library. First. Huh. Surprise didn't target me. How Two did mountains. I do that? Two mountains. All right. How many cards do you have exiled f as that are lands? So a total of five. I get those. Cool. That's a lot you of mana. Get Evolving Wilds, two swamps, and two mountains. Remember that what? from the um, from the betrayal, your exiled cards go back into your yeah, library. Yeah. yeah, I exiled them for escape. Yep. Okay. Cool. Just oh, making sure. That's a good idea, actually. Yeah, he escapes the shit. Well, I figured he had some guard. Right. This is so cool. I don't even care if this is really bad, actually. Sacrifice is perfect now, so we can say mm -hmm. add some clarity. To the game. Yeah. Sacrifice the Terramorphic. I'll get a tapped island. And that will be all for me. Okay. All right. Untap. Upkeep, I have three cards. Draw. I'm going to thank you. Actually, you know I want one of those. <laughs> I took a look at like, damn. It's a thick ass fry. Mm -hmm. mm. mm. going to tap two and I'm going to terminate my own Kroxa. No, why would you do that? We are having such a great time. Alright, Kroxa's dead. There's my graveyard. I will cast oh, okay. uh, Are you going to pay two one for black? terminate? I did not. Cool. I'm not paying, just so you know. I yes. just don't pay on principle. Thanks, friend. Huh. I'm going to cast Aid the Fallen. Return target creature from my graveyard to my hand. It's going to be Krogsa. All right. And then I'm going to bolt Ashiok. Sweet. Ding. Yeah, that's it. Cool. Uh, I'm done now. On top. Up, keep, and draw. Ugh. 
There are ten cards in my graveyard now. Ten cards in your graveyard? Two. Okay. Seven. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. That was up so from far. how much earlier? Well, Six. it might, well, okay, might as well just get One a recount. More. I'm gonna... Black, black, and four. I'm gonna play Sadisi Undead Visor. Once DC Woo! Undead Visor and, and exploit huh. creature, I'm gonna exploit Sadisi herself. Sure. Um, I can search for a card to put in my hand and shuffle my library. And one oh, in the graveyard. Okay. Well, you can't get Gruel Charm, so I think I'm okay. Johnny, do yes. you know what the definition of getting fucked is? Shut up. Oh, dear God, please let this be awesome. No, let me kill someone. Oh, someone's gonna die this time. Doesn't have to be you. <laughs> Doesn't have to be you. It's gotta be you. <laughs> no, eat pant, Dale. <laughs> it's gonna be you. Eat shit, Dale. <laughs> it's gonna be you. It's gonna be you. I play Homeward Tap. Be me. And I'm gonna tap it to gain control of my. Uh, every, each player. Get, each player gains control of all creatures he or she owns. Alright. That's fine. Still can't kill me this turn, you little shit. How big. What's in your graveyard? Uh, uh, what's my graveyard? Yeah, you can't yeah you're gonna have to recount again. all the graveyards again. You can't because it need, needs haste since it entered uh, back into its control. Yeah, when it changes control, it still needs haste. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, I still nine. have ten. Hold on. Nine in mine. Two, twenty-eight. Forty-five minus seventeen. Math. Forty-five minus seventeen. Mm -hmm. That's that's twenty-eight. Thank you. Twenty-eight plus how much did you get? How much was in your graveyard? Oh, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine. Okay, so it's gonna be. There you go. Thirty-seven. Big maths. Yes, big math. Big brain math. Big math. Um, Waiting for Johnny to steal it again. <laughs> right, it's gonna happen again. Yeah, who builds a deck like that? That's just fucking stupid. Oh no, <laughs> someone with too much plays money. It off. <laughs> <laughs> um, you know, without all the bling in it, it's actually quite a cheap deck. <laughs> like I said, someone too much money. <laughs> <laughs> hey, let's I just make this unnecessarily uh, expensive. Um, a Grixis steal everything combat, deck, but then Milf Corona Milf. happened, and I said, maybe Milf I shouldn't three. play that online. <laughs> uh, Mill 3, everybody. All right. Shout out to Flame Caller. Plague right. Wind. It happened. Shout out to Grixis. Add 9. Oh, I'm, up. I'm up to 46. I almost handed you a Sharpie. <laughs> <laughs> um... All right, get on with it, Dale. Eat my butt, Johnny. <laughs> <laughs> I like how you started with Final Fantasy and went to Pokemon. Yes. I moved, so I had one still. No, uh -huh. I moved to Combat Array, so that fizzled. Too bad. Um, yeah, I guess I'll move to Discard. Sweet. Mm hmm. I can't attack. All right, just gonna two, just gonna three, untap four, five, Arena these lands. Eight, nine, seven, uh, turn your upkeep. How many cards in your hand? I got one, so I will be taking a bolt. Three, yep. One, two, three, All right, four, five, eight, let's six, seven, draw for eight. turn. Let's discard one more. Reliquary Tower. Fucking thing. This is good. Pass turn. Perfect. Yep. Damn, that's a rough life. Uh, the rough neck base. Can I see that graveyard? Here you go. This is just far too brutal. Oh, right of replication. Mm. Gonna make you eat my poop. Chamber of You will do no such thing. Eat poop. And such great cards in here. Who needs bling if you got bang anyway? Exactly. Who, need, if, what? <laughs> Who needs bling if you got bang anyway? <laughs> what the hell? Famous words. I'm gonna attack uh, Dale with uh, Ash with uh, Atrith. How? For uh, three minutes. Three two minutes. Three two minutes. Yeah. And you know he's got like a, a 46, 46 46. I'm sure he's aware. <laughs> oh. And another creature. Well, at least I'll kill his thing if yeah. he blocks. Does it have death touch? No, I mean it's a three two. That's a 
That's uh, three two. Oh, whatever. Does your character guy have flying? That's menace. No. Oh, it's menace. menace. Yeah, fuck it. I'll block with both of them. Okay. Kill your little one. I've got enough fun milling you guys. Uh, thing two. Tap one two. Uh, three four. Five six. Let's go Cast Atris. Nice. Once more. You're gonna be Three. laughing, Brandon, when you in a year you're gonna sell that deck for a million dollars. I fucking wish. <laughs> With oh the my rate God. of how magic inflation's going. <laughs> who, who are you choosing? Honey. All right, let's take a look. Um, put. <laughs> um, put the one on the left. Uh, can you can you shake it a little bit just so we make sure that's the one on the left? Okay, there you go. Put that one and the middle one in a face-up pile, third one face down. There you <sighs> go, perfect. I'm pretty sure if in two, three years you could sell it for a mortgage. <laughs> Maybe. I Might as well. Well, what we go up to? 23 cards? I mean, it's only gone up 15% since I bought it, which is not bad, but... I mean, Sunken that was hollow. all the masterwork required. That was less than a year uh, ago, though. Let's play Mindstone. Was it last? I think it was more than a year ago now. Island, crack Mindstone, draw a card. During, uh, sure thing. 24 hour. Oh, true. <clears throat> Very true. 24. I've got 24. I've two, uh, three cards of Bounty Grave for me this turn, Del. You got 20? Three. Uh, I've had three cards go to Grave. Cool. Yeah. Nine. All right. Nine, uh, nine, nine, nine. <clears throat> I'm going to. Ah, shit. Uh, do you play the commander again, John? You can draw. Oh, cool. Yeah. Solid Snake Jr. Solid Snake Jr. See, you've got like 40 mana, and I'm, I'm scared. I'm scared to find the point when you're able to use it. <laughs> uh, it's uh, it's never more's turn. Oh shit! Oh, I didn't realize that. I'm tap upkeep. I have two, so I'm fine. Draw. Sweet. <laughs> <laughs> what are cards in Thank hand you. for everyone? Thank you. Two. Uh, one card in hand. One, two, three, four, five, five, six, seven, eight cards in hand. Okay. Um. Fireball. I'll do the. I'll do the responsible play. So I'll play Croxa. Uh huh. Drawing. Um. On the trigger, I will respond by overloading Cyclonic Rift. Oh, okay. You beautiful man. Um, drawing. It still triggers. Card. Yes, it, uh, do, it does still trigger. Right. Uh, let, me, let me figure out this, this mana situation first. Uh, because I'm also going to activate my Academy Ruins if the mana allows for it. Uh, so let's do that first. So. The Heuristic Study bounces too. Yes, that will bounce. He still got the, the, the cast trigger. Uh, so I'm gonna, <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna Academy you. Ruins, and Happy let me see, deal. one, two, three, we four, five, six, seven. Oh, perfect. Yeah, so, you're gonna get to draw a card. Cool. Academy Ruins is from your graveyard. Yes, oh, my bad. Picking up the wrong fucking uh, pile. Gonna go to a Krupsa. Cool. So everyone's on this card. Yes. There's no torment in this deck, Phantom. That's in the the Demon's deck. Cause oh yeah, that's what I couldn't find. I was looking for Hellfire. Ah, mm. just looking over anyway. That would be spicy. Putting uh Vodalkin Shackles on top of my library. Hey Dale, make sure you bounce the Ristic and the friend. Yeah, those bounce. Oh yeah, got them. <laughs> I was waiting for it to resolve. You could just save your mana before casting your uh, your trigger, Johnny. 
for the Academy Ruins. You could just save that mana and just wait till your turn. Uh, no, I, I, well, I could save that. Uh, you're right. I could At save the that end mana of and Dale's wait my turn. turn. Yeah. That would be smart. Do you want to do that? Nah. Okay. I'm fine with it. I'm going to tap two again mm -hmm. to play Kroxa again. Drawing. All right. Sounds good. Going to get uh, bolted. Did you play Kroxa twice this turn? Yes. Okay. I got, yeah. discard. I got two discards I need to do. And uh, Jonathan, have you been getting bolted, by the way? Um, Why would I get bolted? He's... It's my shrieking. Oh, uh, no. No, no, from uh, the no, Kroxa. Oh, no, I discarded a card. Okay, oh, okay. just making sure What's, both what? of your cards are uh, non lands. What I triggers my oh, just non lands? Yeah. Okay. I'm discarding Magatory, Great Horn, and Energy Field. I what? don't have Shrieking of Blood anymore, so it doesn't matter. Uh, for, I'll, and then for my last spell for the turn, Ten. I'll play Shrieking Affliction. Ooh, Good turn. Oh, nope, I don't get to draw for that. 20. Wait, how much mana do you have, uh, John Hi. Nevermore? Oh, he only had to do uh, two mana twice and then one more for that. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Croxa was in hand. Right. For both yeah. of those. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like Johnny gave me value town. So. Yeah. Well, why why so, would you hurt Johnny then? <laughs> That's what I'm here for. I'm not going to. I just shrieking affliction. Past turn. Shrieking Johnny. I like that. I'm not here to hurt Johnny. Shrieking affliction. <laughs> How many cards do you have in hand, Johnny? None. Excellent. <laughs> this is Johnny's fault. Should have saved more money. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Johnny, you should have spent more on that deck. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. <laughs> You're lacking money in this deck, Johnny. <laughs> the only money I actually paid into this deck was I went out and bought Kropsa. Stark, for thank like you for the bucks. tears. Appreciate it. Four, Unfortunately, I spent too much money on that deck, so... <laughs> and it's not even completely, like, finished yet. Oh, don't worry about it. You'll cash in for a car mm -hmm. later. Mm -hmm. So for my land for turn, I'm going to play a Hinterland Harbor. I have an island, so it comes in untapped. It's a land harbor. Um, oh, oh. Claude, thank you. Actually, I could probably sell that deck and pretty much have paid for my motorcycle. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I bet. Or you could wait a year and buy a house with it. Right? That's oh awesome. my god. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> when the market turns and Green. stonks aren't worth it. Tap this. I have two floating colors. I'm going to play Peer, Imaginative Rascal. Uh -huh. Toothy's not in my deck, so. Okay. Oh. Uh, sad. That is a sad Peer. Feast says He's three more hours, boys. Here. What's in three more hours? Thank you. Brandon McHoy come play on stream. At some point, give him the webmander bug. <laughs> um, I'm trying to get him to play on stream. He just refuses tap to. Tap these for two Thank green. You again, Stark. I have two floating colors. I'm going to play Spike Weaver. When Spike Ooh. Weaver comes into play with three 1-1 one -one counters on it. Up here. Oh, got four on it. Yep. Stark, so you can tell Koi whenever he wants. He knows that we stream on Tuesdays and Saturdays, but every time, conveniently, his kids act up and he can't make it. <laughs> Ever since he lost one game here on stream, he just magically can't make it. Oh, that's brilliant. 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 You said you had hey, Spike what? for that gift sub. Um, Spike Weaver's ability. I could pay two Welcome to remove poster. a 1-1 one, one counter from it to put a 1-1 one, one counter on target creature. Or I could pay one, remove a 1-1 one, one counter from Spike Weaver to fog. Okay, is that going to make it bigger or fog? Yes. Sorry, I was showing off my pretty... Uh foil spike feeder that I got for playing on the spike feeders. Oh, sweet. Holy shit, I'm gonna call. Here's our new G3, <laughs> thank you. Oh my god, I, I'm so scared of all these all these new surprises. I'm discarding that pop up. a Dreamtail Heron and a Bonte's oh, Monument. My man. <laughs> oh, feast god again. damn it. Feast. Yep. All the gifted subs. Oh, good. Yes. Okay. Uh, pyro fighting it out with wallets. Right? Man, you guys are monsters. I love it. Keep going. This hurts me so much. The hype train, oh, level two. Good. Fuck yeah. I love it. Don't no, with please. The Dalcon Shackles for three. Oh my uh, gosh. Move to combat, swing at Dale for two. You took three damage during your upkeep? Oh yeah, right. Gosh. There we go. There we go. Um, yeah, I'll let you get your land. I'll block with my friend. He's taking no damage. I just draw a card. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I've been taking the I've been taking the damage. Hmm. I mean, I'm just chilling. 
<laughs> no one just chills here. Come on, are you serious? I mean, look at the life totals. <laughs> yeah, one of these life totals are not like I'm gonna, the other. I'm gonna pass turn. Uh, or a Boric form. You mentioned how do I join here on chat? Well, um, if you enter on our Discord, if you have a channel, go ahead and link it there um, and let us know that you're a content creator and maybe we can get you in here. Um, uh, how many cards do you have in hand, uh, John? Very. Uh, enough to not worry about it. Okay. The, the amount of lands that John has gives me so much anxiety right now. <laughs> like so much anxiety So over many lands. <laughs> uh, let's see. One, two, Holy shit. three. Living four. in a nightmare. Okay, train choo choo. <laughs> Paravok. Paravok. Hell yeah. Thank wow, you for the thank cheer. You. Hype train. Woo, woo. 11, 15, uh, 19, 20, 21, 23 mana. All right, shit. Let's just go Reasonable. ahead. And, wow, uh, you have more mana than my dino deck, <laughs> dude. <laughs> tap four, tap three. Um, we'll play <laughs> Ashok. Yeah. Hey, yeah. finally 24 months. What yeah. What the fuck? Not <laughs> sober. Hell yeah. God, we've been waiting for that. Thank you. I haven't seen any of these notifications. I'm like surprised every single time something new happens, dude. A brand new stream, baby. A brand new stream. Like the mighty Phoenix. Tick this up. I'll target uh, Dale. For what? Uh, Ashiok Nightmare Weaver. Exile the top three cards of your library. One. Two. Three. <laughs> sword of light and darkness, fabled passage, and blood strain. Oh yes, I can use all of those. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. No, no, no. Sword? no. no. <laughs> oh yes. <laughs> Your turn, oh, no. Dale. No, no, no. <laughs> and our two, our um. Uh, what is it? Uh, temple, and we'll tap uh, two swamps. Six. Uh, target Dale to exile four cards. On top no, of no, no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so we're... One, two, three, and four. You got um, Beast Whisperer, Birds of Paradise, Platinum Angel, and Wayfarer's Bottle. Brutal. I'll take all your exiled lands. All right. Ugh. Fable Passage and the Windswept Heat. Um, yes, Flooded Strand. That's why I was so happy yeah. it was Flooded Strand, not Windswept. Woo, yes. Windswept. Did these guys stay exiled? Yeah. Oh, uh, tech, yeah, because you didn't hit creatures off the Ashiok. Uh, I'm gonna crack the uh, Fabled Passage in the Flooded Strand. Alright, so you're gonna take it's, one. Take one. I, mean, I think I the graveyard. Oh. Should I have Mayhem down with this deck? I think that'd be mean. I, think it, I mean, you're not a sex. You're just nah. every time it dies. Are you sorry? <laughs> nah, I just do it. It's not mean at all. There, there are a lot more mean things to do. That, that's perfectly fine. My <laughs> man. I'll tap. Uh, Thanks. Holy Jeez. shit, Paravok on another spree. You guys are Level out of control. Holy shit. Train. Wow. Level three. Wow. Thank you very much, Paravok. Yeah. Uh, and everyone My else man. who's, you know, gifted subs tonight. Both of you guys are monsters. We got a lot of emotes. Uh, cast Atris or Full of Half This will be the third cast. I paid eight for him. Uh,. I'll go ahead and target Johnny My again. Man. For the it's like the most right. I, I like this game. Level <laughs> 5 hype train. Good job, chat. My Thanks. man. Level 5, wow. Alright, put um 1 and 3 face up and My the man. other one face down. The final level. It's the this final one. Yeah. countdown. There you go. Perfect. I'll My take my Yep. <laughs> I'll take the face up Mimnark. Yeah. Um. Hmm. Ooh. My man. Ooh. 
I would like to cast riches. Yeah. Wait, how do you cast that from your graveyard? As an aftermath. Fine, 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 fine. Same cast from his graveyard. Nice. Full value nice. on that one. Nice. I might play the land this turn. Uh, it's kind of hard to keep track. <laughs> We're all just going to say yes for the foreseeable future. <laughs> Dang, thanks for the okay. gifts, G3. Uh, thanks, tap Nick. one, two, three. Uh, Damn, seven. G3 helping that hype train. Holy hey, shit. Cheshire. Get, uh, Johnny, give me, uh, Dale, give me one of your creatures. <laughs> Thank you. Um, which one Two do you years want? And 666 yeah, hours you. later. You can appear. Okay. I like kids. 666 hours. I love it. Fast turn. Gosh, damn. This ramp uh, is bad. Absolute madness. <laughs> Too bad Homeward Path doesn't work for, like, other permanents. It works on creatures, though. I know. Yeah. I mean, the only thing I can think of that works like that is brand. Card yeah, but there's only yours, not everyone's. Mm -hmm. Sadly, you're all off brand. <laughs> Card in my hand is three. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. I think Johnny only oh, has this one. Completes oh, the high yeah. train. I got one. We'll beat Dale, how many cards in hand? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And they're all upside down. <laughs> um, Thank I'm going to pay five, oh, and I'm going to cast Skullrend. Deals two damage to each opponent, and they each discard two cards at random. <sighs> Two damage. Damn. Hey, Feast, Rip. thank you very much. Oh my god, this is just crazy. Absolutely love it. In response, I'm gonna tap Homeward Path to get my peer back. <laughs> cool. Shuffle. Stuff does this resolve? Multiple of three. Yeah. One, two. Three, four, uh, five, what are six. you doing? Discarding two cards at random. No, never four. more. What are you doing? Uh, scroll rend. Uh, uh, deals two damage to each opponent. They each discard two cards at random. Right. Yep. Okay. All right. <laughs> Consuming aberration. Transfer. And uh, sunken hollow. Yes. <laughs> Everything good's gone. <laughs> Good. Dude, I know. It's like it's time to to delay the pain. Oh, I think you're gonna say duel. <laughs> it's time to, it is time <laughs> to duel. Does. Pass turn. All right, you, you scoundrels. Elder Dragon times. You, you. <laughs> this deck works really well for, you know, Commander, because its game plan is to not have a game plan and make sure no one else does. Oh, well, there you go. I'm going to play a Flooded Grove. I'd like to point out that two of the decks are on mill plans. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> been amazing. Yeah, I have a dream. To have a dream. Have a dream. So, yeah. I'm, I'm living the oblivion sower dream. Dear God. <laughs> you really are. <laughs> it's <laughs> horrifying. <laughs> oh, man. Let's count how many stolen lands so far. Uh... Oh, yeah. That's not counting the two fetches that I stole <laughs> and cracked. <laughs> oh, oblivion sower. You're such a good boy. <laughs> Which well, you're, you're good at um, extra dimensional horror. I'm Not horror. About something like powerful. Uh huh. Mm. <laughs> Thank you. Do it. Do it, Dale. Yeah. It's your birthday. Yeah, it yeah, is. It sure. is. It is my birthday Actually, after all. Yeah. I'm gonna do mm -hmm. a. Yeah. One. So a two. Six, <laughs> seven, and uh, eight. For eight mana, I'm going to play... Well, actually, let's hold off on that. You can First, always uh, cast your command and then cast that uh, fucking abomination thing. Get a little big thing out there. <laughs> I'm going to swing at Johnny for five first. <laughs> That's fine. I'll take five. That seemed like Johnny earned that. No, but, I've been but, a fan wait, 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 but Dale, but Dale, I have, I have a plan for this, and it, I think it, it's something that you would really like. You, you just have to cast that thing out of your graveyard. <laughs> I have a plan for this. It's not gonna hurt you. <laughs> Johnny takes five here. <laughs> but you're gonna. S no, that's okay if you take it. Hmm. Yeah, you can always get uh, it back. Hmm. I don't have enough man to play it though. 
Oh, that's too bad. Yeah. If I play <laughs> Moldrotha, I need 11 mana. I have 10. Ah. Uh, Do I? Yeah. One, two. Yeah. Actually, yeah, I have 10. I feel bad at this point. Just so, taking the true damage. <laughs> for eight, I'm gonna... That will just help Samurai Dancer, I think. It would. Never mind. Um... All right, Dale, let's just play for value then. Fuck. Um, play will draw that. Get it out next turn. It's, it's, it's gonna right. be it's gonna be Careful. beneficial for everyone. <laughs> I guarantee you. <laughs> it's gonna be spicy tamales. Spiciest ones. Why well, do I have a feeling you're gonna make sh everyone get Muldrotha except me? <laughs> no. That's not in this deck, Dale. I, 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 I won't, That's in I, my dragon deck. I, I, I won't touch. <laughs> I won't touch Muldrotha. That is my that is my solemn promise to you, and I kiss every promise before I send it out to people. I, g I gently kiss every promise. I don't. <laughs> well, the promise from Johnny. Just... <laughs> You'll excuse me. I need to make a quick call for a second and get a beer. Sure thing. So I'm F6. <laughs> All right. You got it. <laughs> yeah, Johnny, what deals can we make? <laughs> mm. Yeah, let's do that, actually. Um, One, a two, a three. And uh, one floating. I'll go and play out Muldrotha. Okay. For the first time. With the one floating and the. Uh... God, think this through. Sounds like a metal song. I'm gonna tap. The green <laughs> to <laughs> yeah. Let's tap the green yeah. for the, hard the, the scales. Metal. Wait, did you play a land this turn? I am pretty sure. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I, it was in my hand. Gotcha. Um, I'm so desperate for that for that what? oblivion sorrow because I mean that not that the aberration because it's just gonna be funny. <laughs> My apologies. Okay. Did I miss anything important? Oh no no, you're you're perfectly fine. Welcome back. One blue and the uh, one floating Shit, to do uh oh, Bike Weaver's uh two mana ability, which is a remove a counter, add one counter to a creature. So you'll be adding two counters every single time you do that. Yep, so it goes up to six. Alright. That's nine. Six. Too bad you couldn't play your uh your dude. My dude, yeah, right? My dude would have been nice. Um, and I will pass after that. Um, and in turn, I'm gonna do two things. My drink for the night. Pause, it pause, is. Dale. Harden and Pier, and Pier. So it goes up three. Oh, it goes up three? Yeah. Oh, no, brewing. Big one wave, more. golden ale. Ooh, that's a nice, uh, that's a nice drink. Oh, okay. That's right, because Harden and Pier recognize each other. Uh, yeah, but, um, you're, you're bringing it up twice because you take off a counter to put on a total of three. So one gets negated. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's a net rise of two every time. With... No, wait, 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 wait. Actually, no. He puts a counter back on himself, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, never mind. He is right. It's three. Holy yeah. shit. My bad. I, I am out of it tonight. Uh, end of turn, though. I'm going to pay two to Academy Ruins. And I'm going to target... Uh, Alter Dementia. Oh, I to go back on top. I see. Ooh, John's got that log of Ulin. <laughs> and then, uh, I see now. I and see. then with my <laughs> other remaining mana, I'm tapping Vidalcan Shackles to steal the Oblivion Sower. So I'm going to steal that little Oblivion Sower, and then I'm going to untap. Draw. Yeah, I've got the, the Don Julio aged in log of Ulin barrels, and that is also really good. Yeah, it is. Uh, two for Ultra Dementia, then I'm passing turn. All right. Oh, that would be cool. I see, I see. That would be pretty cool. Swag. Uh, oh, yeah, that's right. I can just cast my commander, can't I? Never mind. I'm going to do that. My one take back for the night is to cast my commander. That's fine. I forgot I had one. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> She's just to the deck space around. No big deal. Uh, <laughs> right. Just a box topper no one asked for. Uh, <laughs> I would like to try to cast uh, Mimnark. 
Seems reasonable. Tapped out Rakdos deck. Uh, four, five, six. Where is that replicator tower? G3 hates everything nice. <laughs> G3 hates his own decks. Oh. All right. Cast Memnarch. All right. That happens. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. Um, one, two, three, four. Feast, I was drinking some Baja Blast a little earlier ago. Oh, you son of a bitch. That's... You have Baja Blast? Yeah, that shit's so good. <laughs> I think Taco Bell is down the street for me, so. That shit's like well, crack cocaine. It literally just destroys communities. I fucking want Baja Blast so much. We haven't have the, had, haven't had that in years. We have the slushy version of it too. Johnny, Johnny, what? Johnny, what? Johnny. No, just play the thing. What? I'll just play the thing. Tap to it's not my turn, Dingo. Just do it, and stop tap. singing the yeah yeah yes. <laughs> you can't tell me what to do. You're not my dad. I'm 30 now. I'm a man. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, I did give you the cake. Is it physical hours? A artifact? Uh-huh. I will tap for and gain control of it. Which one are you targeting? Of what? With Memnarch? What are you targeting? Uh, Moldrotha is an artifact, and so is Homeward Path right now. Oh, did you put out a Microsynth or something? Oh, no, you turned got... things into artifacts with the Memnarch. I forgot about that. All of them. Shit. <laughs> I'd like to gain control of Homework Path. <laughs> sure. Everybody else stealing my shit. Why not? Wait, how much does it uh, cost to activate? Uh, uh, it costs four, and I paid. You know, it. I'm gonna tap it in response. Here, have your yeah, tap that's... land, jerk. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tap one, two, three, four, and I'll gain control of uh, Moldrotha. Okay. Whew. All right. Let's see what good stuff I have in Grave now. Thank you, Paravok, for providing people with so much joy and keeping the community alive. Uh, ooh, these are all good things. These are good things. Um, I will play this Mox Amber uh -huh. for my Grave. I will... Five, six... <laughs> uh, do, 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 do you have do, any idea how much power you wield in your hands right now? Tap four. Um, I, I guess uh, maybe, maybe I do. Five, I am. I'm horrified. <laughs> I will cast uh, Garuda, Doom of the Depths from Grave. Uh huh. All right. So we have to mill four each. Is that what it is? Correct. Everybody mills four, okay. and then I may select one even creature from among those. You whiffed on me. Whiffed on me. Uh, I got a Frost Titan Ooh. out of my yeah. four. I'll choose Spark Double, having it come into play as a copy of Garuda. Cool. Oh, Do gross. it again. You got a sack one, don't forget. No, uh, not Legend. Yeah, that oh. one that makes it come as, as not Legend. Ooh. You build for me Surly Badger Soar and Dread Horde Butcher. Got a so Consecrated Sphinx, Chasm Skulker, and Master of Waves as the, the creatures that went in the graveyard. Paradise Druid and Insatiable Hemophage. Yeah, I'm thinking about Consecrated. I never get to play that card. Gross. <laughs> Everything's horrifying. Damn it, and you milled my Ob Nixilis. Moltrotha. <laughs> uh, you want to put that down, Shiny? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> All right, um, and I've got a homeward path. That will be all. I mean, I could swing, but I mean, I'm not that kind of guy. Uh, pass turn. Untap, uh, upkeep, and draw. Hey, look, it's a land. Uh, you drew. I draw two cards, correct? From Consecrated? Yep. Yeah, something like that. Please, someone have this man mill right before his turn. I'm gonna tap 
four uh, exile uh, thread horde butcher delirium schemes thrill of possibility skull rend I didn't do it I forgot and I didn't want to take it back I already had a long term aid the fallen exile all those and uh yeah boy I've got right. a clean hand Croak Serena going down oh, discard Sylvan Library the boy is hungry <laughs> I'm going man. hungry yeah. alright uh, go everyone did their things yeah. yes go cool. faster Untap. How many cards did you get yourself? How many what? Cards? I have four. Okay. Upkeep and I'll draw. I'll draw two. You know what? I fucking hate that. Um, one, <laughs> two, uh, six, seven, mm. eight. I'm gonna play Slin Voda, the Rising Deep kicked. When it I enters the you. battlefield, if it was kicked, return all creatures to their owner's hands except for merfolks, krakens, leviathans, octopuses, and serpents. Uh, Yay! In response, I'm going to uh, tap and sack the Oblivions, or whatever I take, did I take the Oblivion Sower? Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to sack it to Delira. Can't. She has summoning sickness. Oh, that's right. I did it fucking last turn. Yeah, all but right. you can sack it to... Alter Dementia. Going to make John Samurai Dancer mill six cards instead. Is it six? It's five, eight. It's a five, eight? So, Let me see. Oh, yeah, it's never a five. mind. It's uh, five cards then. All right. Yay. I have Crooks in back. Hey, cool. Notion Thieves, we'll thank you. I'll drop this to my hand. Thank you. Oh, oh man. <laughs> How much value have I been just grabbing from people's, like, oh, you get Oh, yeah, cool. Thank you. I'm and, at a loss for everything that's been happening. <laughs> uh, Dale, the rest yes. of your creatures go to your hand. Oh, that's right. I would pop the, uh, you know what? Pop the what? To fog. No, it's only until under turn. That's a waste of mana. Value. No, this is value. I'm going to tap this for a blue play, <laughs> Mystic Remora. You tell him what value is, Dale. <laughs> you Wait, tell him what value is. Don't your creatures go back to your hand, though? It's not Slimvoda. Gonna so untap those the then. Yeah, but don't, you're Spike. Oh, they're right. Spike yeah. Weaver's in my hand. Thank you. I'm trying to help you out, man. Well, trying to fight me and you, shit. You keep backseat playing. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> trying to help you out. God. All right, consecrated Sphinx. <laughs> um, going to. Oh, how many cards do you have in your hand on your upkeep? Oh, I had three. Or right, two. I have two cards in my hand. On top of upkeep, bro. Yeah, two cards in my hand. You good? Okay, cool. Still alive by thin margins. Okay, uh, Consecrated Sphinx, pass and turn. Alright. <laughs> cool. You play Consecrated Sphinx, creature fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Not this time, Satan. Oh, sweet Jesus. Um, what, can I, uh, what? Am I the ghost voice? In your grave. Uh, what, what's in my grave? What? I need to see instants and sorceries in graves. Oh, okay. Is this at your upkeep or your main phase? This is your main phase? Yes. Okay, draw two before you do that, Johnny. All right. Johnny, draw two. So, draw two, actually drawing four. Because two per card. Oh, yeah, two per card. Uh, so, I've got Cyclonic Rift, Polymorphous Jest, um, Blade Thievery, and Rite of Replication in my graveyard. I have Shadow of the Grave, Plague Wind, Lightning Bolt, and Terminator. And Dale. I only have permanents it's... in this deck. Ah, uh, that's right. I forgot. That's awesome. Ooh. Okay. I'll tap, um... Cards back. I'll tap this Temple of the False Gods. Mountains. These mountains. What is this? Oh. Now this is a homeland. So that's Five. Um, let's see, is there any other points? Six. And a swamp. And I will cast Memnarch. <laughs> All right. 
I will tap one, two, three, four, and I will target, target Altar of Dementia. Um, fuck. Let's tap and uh, tap Dalkin Shackles to um, try to gain control of Memnarch. Uh, I gain control of it. Uh, the Dalkin Shackles lets you gain control, right? Yes. So you guys are doing a swap -a uh, Haru. I think what I'm gonna do in response to that is tap one, because you only have one island up after that, right? Uh, yeah, I'm floating um, one blue from the Guild Lotus since two was for the activation, so I have um, a total of two blue potentially available to me. Okay, okay. Um, I think I'm actually okay with that. So I'll take the altar. Wait, okay. wait, wait, wait. If you're resolving it, he's going to get the Memnarch before you would get the altar. Oh, yeah, that's fine. He's still going to get the altar, though. Yeah, but you can sack yeah. Memnarch to the altar if you want before you lose it. That uh, is true. Wait, you have a fucking Homer Path, don't you? Maybe. Yeah, no, I'm going to have to fucking sack it. All right, I'm, I'm going to sack it and make you mill. Okay, four. You're right about that. Four. Six. Grave. Okay. So I get altered. Yes. Okay. Let's so go. Mark's gone. Thank God. Uh, I'd like to tap one, two, three, four. Uh, that's a minimo, and that is a fairy enclave. So that is a swamp. Swamp, swamp, swamp. Three, four. And I'd like to play uh, Spark Double, targeting my Garuda. Well, not targeting. Spark Double on the stack. Give me as a copy of, yeah. Uh, I'll I get back Garuda. Mm -hmm. uh, everybody mill four. All right. One, two, three, <laughs> four. <laughs> oh, <laughs> gross. <laughs> Got Baby Godzilla and uh, Foreign Ancient. Forgotten Ancient. Oh, is that a void? When, uh, but Void Winner is 9, isn't it? Yeah, it's 9. I'll take the Clever Impersonator. Alright. <laughs> it's going to come I'll as a copy it. of Garuda. Uh, spark Double? <laughs> oh, that Spark Double, right. Alright. You're going to mill 4 again? 4 again? Hey, Claude's pointing something out in chat. Uh, spark oh. Double wasn't balanced because it was, as it was a copy of Garuda before. That is a good point. So instead, I would like to play... Instead of this original spark double, I'll play memory plunder targeting uh, what's it? your uh, right of replication. Oh, okay. Instead of the okay. So just tap an additional four then. Okay, so we don't no, mill the four. Spark double. Okay, so we don't mill that last four then. Oh, we do we? No. Okay. We do another four because I still get the. Oh, the still gets the clever impersonator, so it happens anyway. It works. Yeah. That works. So we still get the four. Hey, thank goodness that worked out. <laughs> All right. Um, I've only got a thought of delve. That's a like fucking odd creature on my side. You whiffed on me. You got a forgotten ancient and a baby Godzilla. What's the baby Godzilla? Um, each creature spell I cost casts one less to cast if it has mutate. Whenever I cast a creature spell, if it has mutate, draw a card, then discard a card. What are those? Uh, what are they? Are they uh, evens? CMC. Oh, um, this is two and this is four. Yeah. Uh, Forgotten Eight. What's their power and toughness? Forgotten Ancient is a zero three, and Baby Godzilla is a one three. But Forgotten Ancient gets a one one counter every time uh, uh, any opponent. player casts a spell. Uh, I'll take Forgotten Ancient. Cool. Okay. Did you say thought of Adele? Hello. <laughs> yeah, that's why uh, I asked about the uh, the grave at the start piece. Uh, Cause like I did have memory plunder, so I could just copy the, uh, so I could just use the uh, the right of replication from grave. Uh, so that's why I was like, uh, it does and it doesn't matter. It means I can do it one less, but it doesn't affect how many I've done so far. Right. right. Uh, I'll cast my commander. All right. We're gonna go with you again, Johnny. You're my okay. Special <laughs> I'll take it. 
Anthony1224, thank you very much. Yes, thank you, Anthony1224. Everything is horrible. Put the f first two face down, third one. Uh, wait, no. Other way around. Yeah. First two okay. face up, other one face down. Yeah. <sighs> These are all really. Is good. it a trap? Who knows? I mean, I think I'm going to go for the first two. All right. Sounds good. Yeah. Thief is not something I would play even at in these games i just don't want to bother taking it out of the deck i feel it's a bit um atrocious as far as effects go in casual at least uh -huh. beast uh, you know we got to wow. keep that weeb wow sound i'm gonna go ahead and uh can i get deck checks deck counts sure possible let me see I got 45. 52. Someone's name is too many. And Dale? 33. 33. Okay. Um, that will completely whiff on Dale. I will. I was going to cast the thing that will let me cast instance of sorceries from Dale's deck, and I was like, wait. I just asked this question. <laughs> <laughs> We're not doing that again. Uh, tap one, two, three, four. I would like to cast Talent of the Telepath targeting Johnny. Okay. Who are you going to pay four for that? No, you got a cool fish. Cool. Birthday. All right. What would you like to cast? Uh, what did you hit? Um, Talent of the Telepath is uh, just casting for someone from my graveyard. Graveyard? Is that no, what it is? Uh, Top seven cards. Oh, top seven cards. Okay. And I definitely have spell mastery, so I get to cast two instants or sorceries from them. Six, seven. All right. So hit a uh, path razor of Ulamog, storm surge kraken, and counter spell. Well, I can't cast anything, so I'm just gonna let those go to grave. Sounds good. Uh, next, we're gonna tick up uh, Ashiok, targeting uh, Dale. What do you want? <laughs> <laughs> uh, what's next? Exile the top two cards of your library. Exile the uh, Navernal's disc and uh, Liliana Vess. Oof. All right, and I've got a total of seven, twenty-one, uh, twenty-one, thirty. Are you getting draws off anything? Uh, not yet. It's, it's uh, turn hasn't passed yet. And uh, I'll pass turn. That All was right. fun. Sounds good. Who would know having lands matters? Yeah, Untapped. pretty good. Play green, so this really is new for me. This should be able to cut a land. Got the fat stack. So step one, I'm going to dread bore consecrated sphinx. Oh, wow, would you do this? The let man's me, got so much shit on the me, other side, me, and you're gonna hit let consecrated. Me live. Let me live. All right, it's just, gone. The Sphinx is dead. Like, I can heavily penalize the. <laughs> Tap two. Croxa! Yes! All right, discarding uh, Fabricate. I'll, I'll discard, discard uh, buddy. Bloom Tender. <laughs> So happy. How many times has that been cast? It's got to be over like six times. Yeah, it's been a lot. A lot. He's it's been value towning this whole time. I love and that I love even it. when you're losing, Johnny, they're still smacking you. <laughs> Let me live, please. <laughs> All right. And, uh. Oh, man. This is That's the power all I got. of blue. Pass the turn. That's I'm simple set. dreams. The I just wanted to dies. mill someone for 50 with the altar. Sure. Simple dreams. Right. Mm. I've got the altar. You've got the altar now, huh? I've got the power. Pub Grace School. What really fucks it is that you still have the homeward path too. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm good. I really, have, this deck has to perform a lot. I'm gonna have one floating, 
uh, Colorless, I'm gonna play Moldrotha again. Okay. And, Sounds uh, sweet. One full and Colorless and uh, two other. I'm gonna play Shielding Plax targeting Moldrotha. Uh, oh, what's that do? Uh, when in Shielding Plax enter the battlefield, I draw a card. Enchanted creature can't be the target of spells or abilities my opponent's control. Uh, I'd like to respond to that. Of course you will. What do you do, boy? <laughs> <laughs> I would like to reality shift your Maldrotha. So what's that do? Exile it and then manifest the top card of your library. So the top card of your library comes down as a 2-2 two, two creature face down. Cool. Okay. Um, now I guess I'll draw a fucking card. You can turn it face up if it's a creature card for its mana cost. It's a uh, creature or permanent? Oh, creature right. card. Oh yeah, Fla Flax is gone. Since it's not a valid target. Mm -hmm. Does it fizzle? Do I even draw? Yeah, it enters the battlefield. Hey, I didn't... I, did I, I take... Sure. If it doesn't have a target to enchant, it fizzles. Oh, okay. So yeah, I guess it doesn't. Happens. Yeah. I forgot I had a forgotten ancient, mm -hmm. but... Yeah. We'll say that's the first trigger. Pass. Actually, Sounds good. No, fuck. Mm. Yeah, I pass. Okay. Let's, uh... <laughs> Let's <laughs> untap. Um, hmm. I'll do that. I have so many Krakens. So many Krakens. Oh, I have to take out a card that I accidentally shuffled in, in there. Uh, so. Cards in hand? I have a lot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right. You won't get me this time. <laughs> <laughs> Um, Can someone please? I need to put the wheels in this deck. Fuck. The wheels on the deck go wee! Yes. Chains on the deck. That they do. Alright, well, let's take control of a. Let's take control of a creature. Uh, Vidalcan Shackle is going to take control of. Going to target? Spark Double Garuda? You're going to target Spark Double Garuda? Yeah. I'm gonna sacrifice it. Okay. Altar of Dementia. Target you. Okay. That's Seven. how much? Seven. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Sweet. Um, let's play a reform for four. And uh, can't really do much else. I guess I can quality duplicate it and then pass turn. Uh, I forgot an ancient trigger. Oop. All right, making a copy of it, passing the turn. Getting another right. ancient trigger. Oop. All right. That's kind of a fish. I just realized <laughs> Nevermore's like day two. <laughs> uh, Surprise. I've been very quiet this whole time. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, draw for turn. Uh -huh. Just casually value towning over here. And you're good for uh, Shrieking Affliction or... Yeah. Uh, I've got two cards in hand. Uh, cards in hand, Jen. Seven. And Johnny? I've got seven. Um, I'll... Uh, Page is surprisingly high life total for this late in the game. And plates Watery Grave. Uh huh. I will tap a. Where's this one? A, a swamp. And I will duress you. Duress me? Grinning. The point of this deck is that um, I. Right, there's a creature on land. Okay, so let's uh, get dressed. That's the point the I've got Mass Polymorph. Uh, Sphinx of the Final Word, Jalira, Lightning Greaves, Island, Mimic Vat, and Scroll Rack. I'll choose the Polymorph because everything else just seems like it's going to be hilarious. <laughs> All right. Well, you could have let the Mass Polymorph go. That would have been <laughs> hilarious. It doesn't seem like it would be my game plan. <laughs> I would what, no like to... ETB triggers? Uh, I would like to tap uh, one, two... Where is it? Got it here somewhere. One, two, uh, three, four, and I will cast uh, Soul Ransom. 
uh, targeting Sylvan, Sliven, the the Kraken. The Kraken. Slim All right, Dale, Slim Vona? Oh yes. Dale, Dale's taking a mighty big um, move. Breastroom break. Yes. Yeah. Did you say breastroom? No. No. Why would you ever think I'd say that? I would never. It say sounded that like life. you said breastroom. I'm just saying. We well, hear what we want to hear, Brandon. Well, I wanted <laughs> right. to hear breastroom. <laughs> <laughs> You're taking control of Slim Vona. Is that what's happening? Yes. All right. You you gonna you gonna kill us? Wait. How how are you taking <laughs> control of these creatures? Uh, Soul like, Ransom. Soul Ransom is, is uh, a spell that does that. Uh, I enchant creature. I control enchanted creature. I can just... Uh, it has on it, discard two cards. Soul Ransom's controller sacrifices it and draws two cards. Only any opponent may activate this ability. So any opponent may discard two cards. Well, let's see what now. Dale does first. So once he puts his headphones on, you should probably tell him the good news. I'm gonna yeah I'm gonna discard two guards in the name of Dale to say fuck that. What's up? Uh, so go ahead and read off what you're doing. Uh, I'm casting Soul Ransom. Uh, I gain control of. I enchant target creature and I gain control of it. Oh, I know any that card. May dis yeah any opponent may discard two cards, and I will sacrifice Soul Ransom and draw two cards. Yep. Greaves and Island going in. Oh, Greaves and. Well, why don't you let Johnny or why don't you let Dale respond because. He doesn't know the target yet. What's the target? Uh, Slavona. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna discard uh, lightning greaves and uh, fucking sphinx to say fuck that. Yay! Woot. Um, if I did that, I don't think I'd get the draw though. Would I? Pretty sure. No, I would get the draw. Yeah, you it, the the response to the discard is after it enters the battlefield. Yeah. But I wouldn't get the two because it's discard two cards. That's the oh, then act to activate the ability. Yeah. Yeah. Controller sacrifices it. Yeah, then so, then you're I'm correct. No sure draw then. Card, so I'll draw the two cards. But uh, uh, Slim would be sacrificed, right? Yeah. No, it still goes back to uh, Dale. Yeah, but it would be sacrificed, right? The creature sacrificed. Or the enchantment sacrificed. The enchantment sacrificed. Oh, okay. uh, gotcha. Yeah. I could let Slivona. I could sacrifice it to alter. But I'd much rather draw cards. Yep. Damn. Seems fair. Because, you know, blue player. Yes. Like, come on. Please put me out of my misery. Blue is life. <laughs> I will tap a swamp and I will play Pyrexian Reclamation. Hell yeah. I will tap a Remind swamp. Remind what that card does. Uh, I can pay two life, return, uh, pay a black and colorless. And return target creature from my graveyard to my hand. All right. Nice. So I will pay a black and a mountain and pay two life, and I will target my good boy Spark Double. Cool. Coming in as a copy of Kairuda, right? Uh, I got to pay four for that, but yeah, that's the plan. One, two, uh, three, four. Uh, target Kairuda. So we mill four. Yeah. One, two, three, and a fucking four. Uh, nope. Uh, you whiff. I uh, got a uh, worm coil engine. I'll take that. You know what I never noticed on uh in on invention worm coil engine the masterpiece? Um, it has this extra text to it and says. Deals twelve damage upon ETP to Johnny to target Johnny. I think I might be dead. I'm gonna pay two life and I'm gonna crazy, return it? to him off a uh, swamp and an island. Actually, off two swamps. Oh yeah, this goes swamps. Get back a Bleeding Sword. I would like to cast a Bleeding Sword. Hey, how are you casting stuff from your grave? I'm returning it to hand with Phyrexian Reclamation. Right, right. Ah. Uh, All right. I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna scoop this one up personally. Yeah. Dude, I, I know I can't is... come back. <laughs> I feel yeah, like I it's also gonna take a while. A much that I can Thank do. You. Yeah. Scooping. No, I really don't have much. Oh man, that was the the Oblivion Sowers. That was Let rough. Me give you real quick. How many times did I cast Croxa? Did anyone keep count? You got to a seven minimum. Yeah. It was a lot. <laughs> It was a lot. <laughs> I was proud of that, dude. Dude, Matt, Matt props on that. 
playing against yeah. one Steeler Cortex and Noah. I'm playing against two as hell. Flat. Holy shit. Uh. <laughs> oh, man. I'm, so, I'm sad that you didn't get to play the deck as it was intended, Johnny, because everything that, like, you could have wanted to play was in your graveyard from being constantly, like, milled. I mean, that was a pretty baller graveyard, to be fair. Oh, and this card. Yay. Oh, man. All right. Wow. Well, that was that was a, a crushing crushing victory. <laughs> All right. Nice well, work, my friends. Uh, I'm seven. so sorry. <laughs> no, that was very powerful. A very powerful. Pick Good winner. job. Oh, man. I, I right, just Polish. never win. Shit. Congratulations, player two. You won. Yeah. Yay. Um, you, nobody bet on uh, you. Um, <laughs> wow. Dale's hell of like, no one bet on you. Get fucked. Get out of here, kid. Seven cards to break. All right. Um, I know. I think I'm ready to call it a night. I got work in the morning. Yep. Yep. I'm done. All right. All right. Uh, thank you both for joining us. Oh, yeah. John, Thanks Samurai Dancer in the Player 2 spot. And we got Nevermore Painting Studio. Shameless plugs. <laughs> yeah. Uh, plug yourselves before before we head out. You go first, John. Uh, Commander in the morning. We play early at 6 a.m. Uh, typical standard time. No. Uh, Commander games Six normal. Percent. All right. Commander in the morning. Play at seven. Okay. Commander in the morning. Is that Pacific time or is that uh, Eastern? Uh, Central Standard Time. I'm in Texas. Central Standard Time. Nice. Texas. And then Four a.m. Good God. And then we got another oh. guest. Nevermore. Painting Studio, aka. Hi, I'm Galvin. I occasionally paint models such as this lovely little number. Uh, hit me up either on the Discord where I'm Guardsman Og, or find me on Facebook at Nevermore Painting Studio if you need uh, models painted to a relatively decent standard for a relatively good price. Nice. Nice. Cool. All right. And for those of you that have <laughs> never seen us before, we are MTG Lexicon. We are the dive bar of EDH. And we're here for filthy, drunken, guilty. Say casual. Guilty is good too. Yeah. <laughs> Commander <Yeah>. content. <laughs> awesome. We got there. We feel guilty. <laughs> always, always full of guilt like over to, here. Uh, Pyro, that would be Samurai Dancer across the screen from me. I'd like to thank you guys, all the viewers, so much for coming to view us and be, saying happy birthday. I appreciate it so much, guys. Uh, yes, happy birthday, my dude. Having a birthday so close to 4th of July, used, I'm used to just spending it alone, but seeing so many people, this has been oh, actually the best Dale. birthday I've ever had, to be honest, guys. It's, I love you, Dale. Can we sing happy birthday, birthday to you before we leave? No, that song's copywritten. Oh, shit, uh, it is. get wrecked. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Yeah, that's why they don't even have it on TV. I don't know that. Yeah. That's fucking nuts. Who owns it? Some fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Probably Disney. If we yeah. change the if we change the words if we change the words, does it still get copywritten? No, or you, or you could just go. Yeah, to because what the copyright is the actual lyrics and melody, so those are both the parts that are copyrighted. But apparently, some motherfuckers want to try to fucking claim functional harmony, but huh, whatever. That's fucking funny. <laughs> Yes. Oh my goodness! All right, well, um, that's a, that's uh, a new thing that I was not prepared to hear tonight. Yep. Um, but how about it. how about this? Been spending most of our lives getting fucked on Dale's hot happy paradise. His birthday comes only once a year, but it's fine because we all share a beer. Um, oh, wait, wait, wait! I just got a text from Coolio. He's, he's he's coming over to beat your ass, right? <laughs> <laughs> Did you make that song up? Yeah, just now. <laughs> We gotta, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta do yeah. that song. <laughs> Let's set down. <laughs> Coolio is, is full of, of rage right now. <laughs> oh, fun fact: Sting and Shaggy did a uh, tour together, and it was pretty neat. Oh shit! Nice. That's cool. Nice. All right. Um, so if you ever want to hear Sting singing "It Wasn't Me," you now can. Nice. Perfect. All right, I'm gonna call it night personally myself. I'm gonna head out. Thanks everyone for being so kind and generous today. Thank you to our lovely guests for being here and playing this some some crazy games. A lot of shenanigans happened today. A lot of shenanigans. 
Um, yes. Thanks to everyone in chat for supporting us. Continue support. Always great. Um, we have a couple of things. I'm just going to quickly plug. We have our Patreon. And if you subscribe to that, like for $1, um, do we sign anything up for $1? I don't remember if we sign anything They get up. access to Discord. They get yeah. access, See, full access to our Discord, including right. our many channels, our yeah, community one stream games. You support us, and you also get access to the discussing things that happen in our Discord. Mm -hmm. You can talk to us personally all the fucking time. Just slap me up whenever you want, if you want, deck lists, whatever. Just feel free to annoy me, really. I really don't care. Um, there's that. There's Flipside Gaming. Flipside Gaming. We are affiliated with them. So if you enter the code Lexicon at checkout, you'll get 10% off your order of $10 or more as long as it's not Warhammer products. Um, everything else, Pokemon, Yu-Gi-Oh, whatever the fucking shit you want, um, you'll get 10% off. Kick a little bit back over here, and we make your eye holes feel happy. Um, at least we, we strive for that. <laughs> so we got all those uh, links over in the chat there. So go ahead and check those out if you like supporting us a little bit more. Um, thanks for everything we you do. We're heading out. Yes. Thank you so much. Donations button. Oh, Hi everyone. We're rolling. We're rolling donations. Which, thanks everyone. These people, love you if all. If you're wondering how this has <laughs> happened, it's possible thanks to these people. All these people, I love you each and individually. Their biceps are huge and glorious. We do this for you guys. You I, guys I thought you were gonna do a PBS kind of thing. Thanks to viewers like you. you. Well, th thank you. Thanks to viewers like you. Thank you to viewers like you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, by the way, Johnny, <laughs> yeah. we talked about this in the past, what? but we got to make an as seen on TV commercial for our tokens. Oh, yeah. uh, I'm down for that. Nice. Looks like we're going to raid down. MTG Alchemy. Oh, oh what? Okay. All right. If we're raiding MTG Alchemy, do forward slash raid space MTG Alchemy. But when we do it, I want everyone that's going to be raided into them to talk mad shit to Koi and spell his name like 15 different ways. K-O-I. Do K-O-I, C-O-I, any, any variation of Koi that you can come up with. C-H-O-Y-I-E. However you want to spell his name, just Call fuck it all up. Even. Yeah, I know yeah, they're really? playing COD. I know they're playing COD. But just absolutely dog trash this man and tell him the MTG Lexicon said to do so. Please. Absolutely please. And ask him why he isn't using the growl. <laughs> <laughs> and tell him that he sucks at Call of Duty. Make sure you tell him that I told you that. Hey, and they're from Texas. <laughs> No, they're not. I thought they were. They're Arkansas. Oh. Oops. Arkansas. My bad. But we did do a whole uh, commander segment with him. We also spent a lot of time in Vegas, which was dope. Had a great time with them. Uh, absolutely love Koi and crew. Um, yeah. Just uh, just make sure you talk mad shit to him. Yes. All right. Let's uh, go ahead and raid these guys. Do you know how to do that, Dale? Um, I thought G3 was going to do it. Oh, let's see if G3 does it. Let's G3. Uh, 20 me, 23 and me G3. <laughs> 20 G3 and me. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. <laughs> They're in my Kansas. Oh. <laughs> nice. So I'm just going to go ahead and hit this stop streaming button right now. Wait, wait, wait. But we haven't moved over, have we? Oh, have we? Oh, nope. I think now we have, right? Yeah, we did. There we go. So, wait. It's Raiden. Sub Zero. Lucane. Raiden. Mortal Kombat. So, I can stop streaming now? Yeah, go for it. <laughs> 